Yeah. Um. Wait. Hold on. Now I want to know. What did I? What did I talk shit about? You I don't know. know. I wasn't even. I had the headphones. Like I had the your stream muted because I can't stand to hear the sound of your voice. And then. <laughs> Chat was just like, oh my god, I can't believe he's talking so much shit. And I just took it, you know, as like, on face value. <laughs> I don't remember what I, if I said anything. It's not working. I, was oh, sent, I sent four of them already. I thought we passed this point in our lives. When you say no, it's, I'm... when you just call up tech support and say, it's not working? Yeah, it's <laughs> Nick, Nick knows what's going on. It has to Don't be worry. more diagnostic, right, man. Just, right, just, you're... You making this a not safe zone for me? <laughs> I, I'm Josh, making. What's up with your voice? Are you alright? Uh, I'm a little sick. Ah, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm a little under the weather. Actually, it's just like my my throat is on fire. Well, that sounds um, like literally... throat. How right, about so, yours? So you though? open Ultimate Chicken Horse oh, and then you alt go. tap out. Wow. And then you accept Nick's thing. Correct. Correct. Yeah. Wait, did my Steam just crash? It's okay, you know, My I don't- My steam actually crashed. I don't want to make this a not safe zone for you, so take as long as you need to get it taken <laughs> care of. Wait, how does Ultimate Chicken Horse open and then my steam crash? That doesn't make any sense. All right. Nick. Do you guys like my DX racer chair? I got oh, a DX God. racer chair made of pixels now. <laughs> <laughs> let's do it, Nick. Let's, let's get this. I have it in front of my other real chair. Wow. Show under road. Penguin Wait, when did you get a DX three? racer chair? Thank oh, you. just this afternoon I googled one. <laughs> nice. Did you uh, swing your magic wand and it appeared behind yeah, you? Yeah, if my magic <laughs> if my magic wand is my dong, yes. Yeah. What, what was the and sensitivity on your magic wand? What was my what? Stop inviting me! I'm already in the game, bouncing I around can't... here. <laughs> Josh just keeps telling me invite, please, so I just keep hitting the button over and over. Are you hitting the button on me? Or Togo? Everybody. As well. No, I just need you to hit it on me. Valden ah! 450. Fist I of only Kane. am hitting it on Ryan now. Samuel yeah, That's what you've been doing. Grand Mages. Appreciate it. There's Rob. Hey, Rob. Hey, how's it going? Really appreciate, you know, being ready. It's, you yeah, pre no preparedness is pretty important. Like, you know, it's not I'm like... the most prepared, and I didn't even know I was wow. on until, like, literally the stream started. That's a good point. So. You found out at, like, 259. <laughs> Shrobro and wow. Tayon Tron and hey, I'm in. Maladapted, thank you, oh, thank my you as well. Gracious, thank you. Can I make this an unsafe zone for you now, then, wow. Josh? Yes. Now that you're in, now you can proceed to unsafe it. Although, I think. All right. This works. Yeah, you, there you are. You're up in the you're up in the sky there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really pulling out the camera so that you can see that there's just an enormous black space on the right side of the screen. But yeah, that's okay. There's the horse. Hey, you guys want to know something cool? Wow. You know what? Nah. Yeah, me either. <laughs> I know. I know enough cool stuff. Really? Yeah. I've, I've reached the end. I've decided that you know I can't learn anything else cool without pushing out something else cool for my brain. So. Wow. That's it. I mean, like 27. That's all the cool that you're gonna have in there. Like, well, I just uh... mean like I'm I'm full. Like I need the new model brain. I need genetic right, engineering. Right. I need to get like a. I don't know, like a 5,000 terabyte brain or something. Right, right. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Um, well, you should get the upgrade. I hear SD, uh, uh or, uh, uh, the, the... Yeah? No, yeah, I'm, I'm with you, I'm with you. Here we go. Let's take this home. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what's happening there, but, uh, I can't wait to see. I like, I like it a lot. All right, good, good level, boys. That was a good level. Right. Yeah, that was stuff, a good one. Stuff. Yeah. Hey, quiz All right, moving on. Next level. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Zan Dam, for the 11 months. Benjamin2197, uh, who says, Rick, I love you. Thank you. And Device2. I oh. wish I could quit you, Rick. Your brain has way more than five petabytes of information stored in it. Is that true? Like, sometimes... Oh, eh, no! You gotta use, like, a different measurement for that, right? Like our Katniss Everdeen and petabytes. Wow. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Cosmic Blues, thank you. Well, um, actually... Long right, you know what, Rob? Tell me something cool. This <laughs> this part of the conversation is just... It, it went well, down this, the shitter this, immediately. <laughs> tell me the cool a, thing. Is, well, I mean, this is a separate cool thing, but uh, actually, long-term memory is... Um, uh, they're not actually sure how big uh, long-term memory is. It's uh, believed in some respects... Oh, God. 
to be um, infinite. What do you mean, as infinite? Far as we know. That just sounds that can't ridiculous. Be true. You well, tell me, I could I mean, store they, they... a universe inside of my brain. I mean, the, the <laughs> reality is we don't we don't actually know, and it's it's kind of impossible to find out. We we can know short term memory. It's seven things plus or minus two, but like um, but long term you can't actually test it. That's I beat you. Oh, you just got it up there. <laughs> This is so fun. <laughs> the other thing, the, the the cool thing that I was gonna tell you is that I can order from fucking uh, Five Guys Five Burgers guys. and Fries now. Yeah, oh, that's not that. cool at all. That's, that's just really like really cool. That's, that's just it's, cool. it's so pedestrian though. Like, it's hey, the I got cool thing that's happened in my life. Oh, oh god! Shit. All right, well, we're gonna be down here for a while. I'm gonna cap off 2016 for you nicely. Have you guys ever considered that? You know, maybe we could hold more than seven things plus or minus two. Like, have you ever seen Darren Brown's Mind Freak? <laughs> you actually can. Yeah. I know Nick. Nick has seen it. That's where he builds the yeah. Mind Palace, and he's like, "Hey, yeah, I needed to memorize every word on every single page of Little Women, so I just built like a nine thousand room house, and then." When I walk into this room, uh, there's a coat on a coat rack, and it's a trench coat, and in the pocket of the trench coat is a business card, and it has all the words on it. Like, okay, yeah. Cool, <laughs> cool, dude. Totally. That is actually a, a thing. Uh, like, you, you can totally actually Is it that. a thing, though? Or, yeah, no, or, or when people do it in front of you, do you just go, <laughs> this guy could be faking it, but he seems way smarter than me, so I'm not going to question it. <laughs> no, it, it actually has to do... I don't think this is completable right now. I agree. Um, I think uh, that bucket. Yeah, maybe, I think but... it's fake, but they use it to try and seem like pseudo psychology or something, so you'll dismiss why it's fake. Yes, I agree, actually. No, no, no. It, it actually, it's like it's partly mnemonic and partly, um, partly relational memory. Because relational memory is actually the strongest form of memory. Um, so yeah, is it the strongest potion? <laughs> it, is, <laughs> it is my strongest. It's completable, potion. guys. Yeah, you did it. But it is it is totally a real thing. You can you can train yourself to do it. You don't have to be you don't have to be <laughs> like a savant to be able to do it. But you what can if your mind palace floods? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then you're gonna be in some issues. I can I yeah, just go I ahead and say real. I like it. I hate this. Didn't <laughs> <laughs> didn't Rob go to school for film? I did my second year of college. My first year, I uh, I studied psychology. Would you film? When you say um, you studied psychology in your first year, major. Does that mean like year, yeah. you you took like psych one hundred and one? I took um, two psych classes. Am I qualified too? Basically. All right. No, Yay. I mean I took, I took like um, I don't know. I took, uh, ah! I took the first psych course. I took intro to psych. I took um, child development, statistics, and uh, like another one. I think I took a class on uh, cognitive behavioral therapy. Um, Co that CBT, cock and ball torture. Yeah. Yeah. Cock, right. Yeah. All right. So that is the method, though. So Fuck, marry, kill. Okay. CBT. The other CBT, and then <laughs> CNN. I would kill CNN. Yeah. Okay. Um, Mary. I don't. Had a little lamb. Thing. You have to fuck yeah. one of them. So like, <laughs> choose wisely. Oh God. I I want to fuck this level. Is what Talk I want. Cock ball therapy. Fuck <laughs> Cox. Ah. This is actually the worst level we've ever created. This is the worst <laughs> fucking thing. You know what? Fuck it. Here, have the points. Thanks for Enjoy. the points, Rob. No problem. I can't believe we've got like at least seven more rounds. Mer Psychologist says, Hello, Psychologist here to say that memory is weird uh, with a chemical and behavioral component. Exactly. What do you mean exactly? Yeah. That doesn't mean it supports your. Oh, thank God for this. <laughs> I, I, I didn't. What am I wow. supporting? There's no argument to support. It's still possible, though, that it's a great exaggeration, and he's got just, like, a freaking oh, card somewhere he's reading off. That's of. exactly oh. it. Oh, are you talking about, well, I mean, I don't know if that guy does it. Have you seen the one with Darren Brown? He goes to the horse race track. Darren it's... Brown goes to the horse race track is my favorite joke. <laughs> this, is where... yeah. this is where I was like, Darren Brown, he's, like, a cool dude, but he's also, like, an asshole. And he's like, check it out. I just lost on this horse racing ticket. And then he goes to the window. And he, like, tries to get them to give him money, even though he lost. So he's like, this is a winning ticket. And then he smacks the wall, like, really hard. And he goes, that's why I came to this window. And then he's like, well, you see, when you say win, it makes them believe that you won. It subconsciously programs their brain. And then I'm like, this is the fakest shit I've ever seen in my whole life. <laughs> 
Well, I mean, there is some uh, basis in that as well, actually, to be totally honest with you. Like, um, yeah, to be totally honest with you. He there's a, <laughs> well, he's, there's not gonna, a, um, he's not going to, like, halfway be honest with you. Well, I mean, there's going to be totally. There was a study on memory about, like, whether, um, whether how a question is phrased oh. affects memory. Whoa, frame rate. Oh, yes, no, we that was bad. But uh, <laughs> how, how a question uh, is phrased affects memory. So, like, the, the example that it was, I think the study was, like, uh, what they did is they made people uh, look at a video of a car accident, and they asked... Well, it sounds pretty people. cruel to begin with here, like... <laughs> yeah, pretty much, yeah, but... Uh, but like uh, they they asked a certain uh, people, certain group of people, like uh, how fast was the car moving when it's all the same video, and they're like how fast is the car moving when it you know smashed into the other car? How car how fast is the car moving when it blasted is, into the other car? Like, oh god, you know like stuff <laughs> like that. And uh, the groups uh, with more aggressive language uh, remembered that the car in the video went thought that it went way faster than it did. Why is that? Because Oops. memory is, you can't really trust memory. Memory is, is, um, is, you can trust uh, me. It? it's suggestible. Memory is suggestible. I can really only hope that my brain thinks that I shouldn't remember this conversation. <laughs> this is telling to piss me off. <laughs> You're asking the questions. Stop I know, and then... then I'll stop answering them. You mean we're stuck up here? That Su pisses me off. Super Max Man <laughs> says, Name that movie. Fuckers. Unsubscribe from Rob Fax. Oh! <laughs> oh man! It really does not We're handle not that email. that yeah. pivot very well. The movie was Tremors. Why am I learning things? Yo, Tremors is underrated, dude. No, the first one's a pretty good movie. It's a that's a good film. Yeah. You just want to talk yeah. about Underground Worms and Kevin Bacon again? Yeah, that sounds good. Reba oh, McIntyre's yeah. in that movie. I am not talking out of my ass. You can look it up if you like. Wow. Yeah. He's talking out of his face, not his butt. That'd be weird. Ah, thank you. Oh, I really appreciate right. that. Fair enough, yeah, that works. I appreciate the resub as well, Bear Axe. You know, I'm going rooftops. I'm like I Bear Axe. Ryan hates me enough already. I might as well make him not hate me anymore. They don't even realize how much I hate you until the next episode goes up. Yeah. What am They'll I realize soon, though. I hope so. Let's have a windmill. What am I doing? Thank you, Kenya Stew, for the Twitch Prime subscription and Jack's Nine Hammer. As well as Kazaz0816 for the two months. How many 45 pound children could you fight? Well, that depends, like, what it is. Like, how old are the kids? Because if they're like 45 pound wow. 13 year olds, I think I could take on like an infinite number. That's a very small teenager. If it's like a 45 pound three year old, I'd be scared. They're gonna have like orangutan strength. Would you think? There's a tipping point for children. Well, I'm saying if you're. Would you rather fight a 45-pound 7-year-old or a 45-pound adult? I'd rather fight a 45-pound 7-year-old because... Or, yeah, a 45-pound adult because... I mean, this is horrible to say, but it sounds like they're ill. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, that like the Beastie also... Boys. Yeah, like, like they have a license to have a disease. I don't think anyone 45 <laughs> pounds could beat you one way or the other, 7 or not. Yeah, but yeah. then, like, how many do you have? Is this like the horse question? Like, and the what are you talking? This question's got a lot of. It's ripe for physical, philosophical discussion. <laughs> I'd say right. I could probably take on like a hundred before getting. That tired. is actually ridiculous. Do they have to be dead? Do I, I don't even think you, you. I don't think you could take on a hundred puppies, <laughs> much less a hundred forty-five. I could definitely no. take on a hundred. There is no. I, I guarantee you, Rob could stomp a hundred puppies. No, and you, you know how quickly you could stomp a fucking puppy in the head. A hundred is so if many, anyone though. If would know, Ryan would be the one out of us. A hundred. Well, he would I'm gonna beat you. Afterwards. I'm gonna beat you. A hundred no, is I way did. more than you give it any credit for. <laughs> Plus, you have to think like, you know. This sounds weird to say, but like kids are really smart relative to like. No, they're not. They're not not relative to us because we're geniuses. Not but a genius. Puppies. Like compared to puppies, they're like. Uh, let me put it this way: if the society was ruled by dogs and there was one kid in it, that kid would be winning all the Nobel prizes every year. That's all I'm trying to say. <laughs> You're not wrong. So you're saying these kids, one of them would figure out to hit you in the nuts with a stick. I'm saying that they're intelligent enough that they could come up with some novel strategies. Yeah. Hmm. Like books. <laughs> What Even do you think about that? In the nuts, though, like, it, there's a hundred kid hits you in the nuts a hundred times. Would you live? You're you're saying you know like one adult-sized Rob wow. could fight forty-five hundred pounds of child. 
Because that's not just 45... <laughs> that phrasing. That's not just 4,500 4, pounds of child. That's also, you know, 200 arms, 200 legs. Well, like, okay, question. Are they all smart enough to attack me at the same time and, like, smother me to death? Well, I mean, Three of them I, aren't. realistically, I don't think they could all get in a shot at the same time, you know? Yeah. They, they'd have to, like, trip over one another. But, yeah, I think, you know, you, you might have to deal with, like, eight or nine at the same time. That yeah, seems... I mean, like, I don't know. Rob has strategies, too. If the kids have strategies, why doesn't Rob? All right, what's your That's strategy, true. Rob? Um, Hit, well, hit them I mean... very hard in the face and other that sensitive regions? Much, yeah, I think, I, think, I think that would be fine. I mean, the thing is, like, if 145-pound <laughs> kids came and they were trying to kill me, Yeah. right? If they were smart, their best strategy would just be, like, you know, suffocating me, basically. Uh, that's a good point, yeah. You know? Like, that would be the most optimal strategy. Yeah, if they just, like, got on top of you, like, Agent Smith got on top of Neo in the second Matrix movie, you'd be, yeah. you'd be in trouble. You'd pretty much be dead, yeah. Like, there wouldn't be no, oh, fuck. no chance. I wouldn't be able but to But they only that. weigh 45 pounds, so couldn't you push them all off? Well, yeah, but if you add, like, 45 <laughs> pounds to 45 pounds, <laughs> like... I'm so scared. You're getting in there, right? <laughs> no. You're right, except I think there's a point oh. where, as long as you're fast enough pushing them off, they could never pile on fast enough to overcome your strength. I don't know, man. I don't know. It depends on how far away they're standing from me at the beginning yeah. of the battle. Well, if they tire you, know? you out, eventually you'd be, like, complacent. You'd be like, all right, I can't push any more kids off me. I guess I'm going to die. That's true. Well, I mean, you can, like, be sad. you can be buried in an avalanche, and snow you weighs know? nothing. So, Second I think you could be buried in a child avalanche pretty easily. <laughs> I mean, secondary question. Okay. Can you... you snow weighs, weighs nothing? <laughs> it, it weighs nothing relative to a child. Yeah, I mean, secondary I question. shoveled some snow. It's pretty fucking heavy. If, you, if every time you shoveled snow, oh. there was a child inside of it, you would know, mister. You would know. Like, oh, right my God. Oh, what a punch. I got it. I got it. He got you it. did it? What? Is it post-mortem? <laughs> <laughs> you yes. laved! You laved! That might be the greatest postmortem I've ever seen in this game. <laughs> so, um... Do you- can you actually, like, can- can- Oh, oh, you, oh fuck. Shit. Can it's you like, actually oh, snap fuck. a neck? Can you snap a human neck? Like, do you think you could- you'd have the strength to snap, like, even a 45 pine child's neck? Pine? A 45 pine child. A <laughs> 45 pine child. <laughs> oh my god. Can you possibly I mean, do it? It couldn't be much harder than snapping a chicken neck or a pigeon or something. I think it could yeah. be a lot harder than snapping. A pigeon yeah. weighs like 10 hard. ounces. But you're fighting for your life, so wouldn't the adrenaline give you more strength than you expect? Or do ah. you not realize you're fighting for your life, so it's actually part of the problem? Well, I, I don't know. That, I, that wow. strikes me as a false dilemma. Doom Squirrel, thanks for the subscription. I just know, like, do, do you know that their intent is to kill, or do you? Yeah, think yeah, you're, just... you're both there. Like, you both groups have been briefed. Oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, if yeah. you know for sure that you like, like, because because the thing is, like, are you going to be able to take them out without killing them? Like, because if they're if they, you know, I don't know how much strength you're going to need to to kill enough that they're right. not going to outlast you fatigue wise. You know oh. What I mean? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know either. I mean, that's the thing. Like, you know, child 1 through 20 is probably going to be a lot easier than child 90 through 100, right? Right, exactly. Like, Nug, yeah. Nug 42 is halfway, right? Like, that's yeah. established. <laughs> that's a great expression. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Deserve that. All right, let's play a game. Okay. What am I eating? Snickers bar. Oh, you need to chew or something. Nope. I am doing. You chew okay, so it's like a it's not a crunchy food, not a crispy fruit food. It's like a soft food. I gotta say, uh, dried apricots. Oh. Hell no. Hell no. Okay. Um, it's a uh, pudding cup. Nope. Mm, I, I uh, actually am chewing. Fruit leather. You are chewing. Is it I'm fruit chewing. snacks? Are it you? Is, not fruit snacks. is it beef jerky again? No. Adult but fruit I have snacks. Beef jerky on the oh, side. Fuck. It has beef jerky on the side. Okay, you got some kind of string cheese then. Nope. I like, but like, what I mean by on the side, like, it exists in this room. That's not, not on the side. side. It's on the side. <laughs> it's like when you order a burger at a restaurant, it doesn't come with, like, a side of the rest of the restaurant. 
<laughs> yeah, all of the cheeseburger with the side of uh, your bathroom, please. <laughs> wow. Alright, that's fair. Shinny oh, Diamond. Fuck. Thank you as well. I will say, little hint, y you may be surprised yeah. by this answer. Ooh, okay. So but it's I'll like, still let you guess. Ooh, going the buzz I'll give you route. another hint. Uh, it, is, it is sweet. Mmm. Oh. Oatmeal. What? No. Cornmeal? Did you say cornmeal? No, I said oatmeal. oatmeal. Okay. <laughs> He's just having like just like a handful <laughs> of cornmeal at a time. <laughs> Raw flour. <laughs> all right, all right. He's eating something sweet. He's chewing. Pumpkin pie. Uh, no, oh. but not too not close. Wow. Gingerbread cookies. No, farther. Okay, no. somewhere, ah. somewhere between gingerbread cookies and pumpkin pie. Uh, yeah, muffin. Ooh, Blueberry that's, muffin. That's a good guess. That's a good guess, but no. Oh. But you're yeah, you're still you're still warm. Okay. Warm. Okay. So it's probably cupcake? a pastry of some kind. Is it an apple turnover? A cupcake would surprise me. Danish. Uh, where are the, where are all the guesses? Cupcake. Uh, <laughs> Danish. Apple turnover. Apple turnover. A fritter. A bear claw. Any kind of donut. And a Claire. No, but cupcake is the closest. So cupcake far. is the closest. Is, closest? is it a yeah. scone or scone? No. Are you eating macarons? No. You guys are going farther from cupcake. I feel. How? What? What is close <laughs> to a cupcake except muffin? I mean, you just take off part of that word. It's cake. <laughs> got it. I got it, guys. He's eating You're a cup. Eating an in. <laughs> I'm just eating or, cake. You're eating an in or a muff. What kind of what, <laughs> what kind of cake are you eating? It's just a white cake with frosting. Uh, white or yellow though? Uh, yeah. Yellow. It's a, mm. So it's angel's food cake. No, I mean like maybe this it's white. This is not of the know, devil. Like an angel food cake. The like, angel food cake is the one with like all the strawberries and stuff, right? No, it's just the no, yellow it's cake. Just the whitest no. of cakes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's probably like, yellow or. It's yellower than Whoa! yellow. Yeah. It's I like mean, it's, an angel, it's like, it's like a, you go to a store, you get like a vanilla cake. That's what it is. I actually like, have what? no idea what that's like. <laughs> uh -oh. Yeah, he doesn't buy cake in I don't, public I don't, I, forever. I don't think I've ever purchased a cake. Yeah, yeah, but you've seen like a cake come in a container. You, you've been to a birthday party. I've been to a birthday party, yes, once. <laughs> <laughs> I can't show you the cake. My uh, my webcam's not working. It's just all frozen. Oh. Why don't you take a picture of it? Uh, he's got you there, fucker. Yeah, you yeah, better wrap got it. him. Rapish has a migraine. Feel better. Oh no, I had one of those earlier. Yeah, they're awful. Yeah, they suck ass. I'm not sure that they actually exist. Oh! What? I don't know. Like I'm still. No, he's right. Actually, they might not exist. The jury's out on migraines, wow. as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> that is absurd. Well, I'm just saying. Like I've never had one, so. Right. Okay. That's fair. Yeah. You know. Have you ever ah! seen a uh, Have you ever seen a trilobite? Yes. So those All are right. real. I've seen. I've never experienced climate change personally, so I don't believe wow. in that either. I mean, that's mm, that's fair. Yeah. That's, you're entitled to. Yeah, that makes sense. But I Have like you. I was thinking like maybe my headaches are like migraines for other people, but I'm just you know stronger than they are. Oh, it's like the button. <laughs> no, no. That's yeah. definitely true. <laughs> <laughs> it's my coin right there for you. Would you hit a button that gives somebody in the world a migraine wow. and you get a dollar? No. Every time no. you hit it. A dollar. Well, is, a dollar is not. You like, can hit it as many times as you want, but somebody's gonna get a migraine every time. You can hit it a million times, get a million dollars, and yeah. cause a million migraines. Like yeah, I, de I definitely would not do that. I would. First I off, I, I well, I mean, I gotta it would run take the a map. a long time to get a million dollars. That's exactly that what I was thinking. How long does it take me to get a million dollars? Because I'm not just getting a million dollars. As far as I'm concerned, I just got a really good paying job pressing a button. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's, that's a good point. Well, but how many times do you think you could press a button in an hour? That's the question. Oh, I can tell you the answer to that because I've done it. I was thinking, like, you could probably pretty easily maintain, like, three times per second for a full hour. Uh, you know, your hand gets tired after about six minutes. Yeah. I Am I imagine. missing something I can tap here? ring finger, middle finger, pointer finger, just like that. One, yeah, two, but three, one, two, three. one Mississippi, two Mississippi. I think you can maintain three times per second for a full hour. I tweeted the cake Try in question. It. It'd be pretty rough. I so mean, then you like... got 180 per minute times 60, which is 4,800 
plus six thousand. Ten thousand eight hundred dollars per hour? Something like that? Is my math add up there? So for an hour of like making the world a terrible place, <laughs> yeah. you would make like as much as Markiplier does for turning his webcam on. <laughs> shots fired! Oh. That's not firing shots! He's a, <laughs> Dude, dude makes a lot of money. I'm not saying he's oh, giving man. people migraines. I'm just saying. Everybody tweet, uh, Mark what did I do? Mark <laughs> what Wait, what would you do about what that? What I said is not even offensive. Trying to put him out of business Whoa. for giving everybody migraines. If anything, <laughs> if anything, <laughs> it's actually uh, it's flattering in many ways. Unlike the rest of you anti-capitalist fucks, I respect a man who knows how to bring home the bacon. I respect a man who makes bacon, personally. Yeah, but, bacon makers. Yeah. Top shelf. Also, nobody get the wrong idea. We're not actually, like, having fun with the idea of migraines. We're just being a little I silly. Am. But yeah. uh, myself and Rob both suffer from them, and they're awful. And I don't Allegedly. Yeah. <laughs> right, yeah, allegedly, yeah. Oh, that was a bad idea. So despite all the YouTube drama that's going on between Northern Line and Markiplier, I just wanted to be clear. <laughs> now, is it Market Plier? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It is. He's in the market for pliers. And he's, business and really, just, is good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he initially made his channel because he was just looking for a sweet deal on some pliers and figured, you know, fuck it, I'll just play some games on it. Really here. took off. Yeah. Really went kind of crazy on him. Wait, Rab, what'd you put down? I don't know. I put, like, a crossbow somewhere. Where'd you want? I don't know. Could this be one. anywhere. Yeah, it's that one right there. Definitely 100% that one. <laughs> it actually was. <laughs> do we know if Do we know if the migraine people have access oh to headache medication at the time? Oh, fuck. It's like their first time getting migraines. They're not people who normally suffer from them, so no, they don't have access yet. I love how everyone thinks I'm the asshole. <laughs> well, you're definitely the asshole. I'm the, I'm the guy who's, who made a joke about migraines. And, I, and then you're like, hey, would you get a million dollars to give a million people migraines? And I go, uh, no, nah, I wouldn't do that. That's terrible. Everybody else is like, how many times can I press the button in an hour? <laughs> and I said I and I'm the jerk, the apparently. None of us want to do that. We're, we're I, having I, fun. I said I wouldn't do And Josh is actually stupid. the only one who, who said he would do it. What would I do? I, I don't even think he'd really do it, though. I don't think he'd do it either. Oh, press the button? No, no absolutely I would. <laughs> I mean, I, I almost feel like... I don't, like, do I know these people? Is the it, like, more time... It's just random people. The yeah, more time you press... The more times, I should say, you press the button, the less egregious it is. If you yeah, press a like button to give like, one person a migraine it, for sure, a like, dollar, a that's not worth it. Get, like, migraines. I'm just speeding up the process. No, you? what you're doing is, like, doubling that, then. They haven't well, had no, migraines. no, if they already have a migraine, they're not gonna get, like, a double migraine. Oh, what, so what percentage of people are suffering migraines at any given moment when you push the yeah, button? Like, point exactly. zero zero one percent <laughs> Yeah, you never know. <laughs> yeah, it's true. A lot of people get, get some real bad headaches. They get, like, Oh, I don't know. Maybe I, uh... Maybe all million times I pressed the button, they already had a headache, so no harm, yeah, no foul. Yeah, exactly. You, you can't know. But I think, like, you're just straight up an asshole if you <laughs> press it, like, five times and then buy lunch. <laughs> You just gave five people a headache to make, like, a really pretty negligible amount of money in the whole scheme of things. If you did it, like, ten million times, I think people would be like, you know what? At least you changed your life. What if you what just if you... pressed it a million times and gave all the money to brain or brain uh, migraine research? That's yeah. Stupid. Migraine? What would I mean, we think about that. that situation? Would that be good or bad or indifferent? What if I we mean, just I... made a pact that every time we got a migraine, we donated like a dollar to brain research instead of requiring this supernatural button? All right, so what about <laughs> yeah, that then? Fair. Like this button. Yeah. Uh, you press it and then you... Uh, you. Oh, fuck. <laughs> someone level. gets a migraine, but that dollar goes to migraine research. Oh, that's a great <laughs> hypothesis. What'd you think of that one? <laughs> you just said it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a hard level, actually, by the it's way. It's getting there. Yeah. Wait, people would actually die? I don't... No, well, it's true. People yeah, can die from probably, migraines. In the wait, wait, but right. when you say die from a migraine, what, what's the actual cause of death? There's... People get seizures from them, and okay. that can cause a bunch of complications. Yeah. I don't know. that Something about that doesn't sound right to me. Also, the like, the level of paint... Wait, what do you mean something doesn't sound right? <laughs> 
I've never experienced it firsthand. Right, yeah, no, of course. You can also get a, can't you get an, a an aneurysm from a migraine? Yeah, I don't think it's very common, but I think it can happen. Yeah. <laughs> right, don't try it. God <laughs> damn it! <laughs> you know what I mean? I switched it, Beaver Duh. Hey, Damari! 17 months in a row. Would you guys press a button if you got a million dollars and it kills a person? Let's just go back to the basics, you know? Definitely not. One button, one million dollars, Yeah. one press. So what yeah, What this question I really wanna, does... I don't, I, don't, I don't think I want to kill anybody. What this question really does is ask you, is it worth one person's life to save a million people from migraines? <laughs> right, exactly. And Josh, I have, to, I have to ask you a question. What if that yeah. person was going to die anyway? Like, all right, so if... This, if all right, give me a scenario. Like, someone is like got into like a car wreck and the doctor's like i'm sorry we've done everything that we can to save them yeah and i mean then, that like, could be the case and then like i pressed the button and like they would just die and right yeah million dollars sure yeah possibly like that or yeah and like the doctor's could, like all right there's no chance that this guy is gonna come back there's there's absolutely nothing i could do yeah in fact in five seconds he will just die right now and there's a beep and then he and then he dies and i get a million dollars right yeah, yeah you got it i'd probably do it you monster. But, but it could be your mom. Wait, wait, do I have this guy's, like, permission? Josh, here's no. a twist for you. The yeah. guy is you. And then <laughs> oh! The a finger curls on the monkey's <laughs> <laughs> Can you just like, say if, that oh, after God. all the things if we I say around? Yeah, sure. it, then, yeah, if not, you know, if he's like, no, don't press that button, I, I wouldn't. If he woke up and... Like... <laughs> yeah, yeah, if he woke up and said, don't press it. What if the button you're pressing is just turning off their ventilator at the hospital? Because like, <laughs> I don't understand. Like this, this comes up so often on the show that I'm like, I don't know. I think like if you eat Dunkaroos as an adult, you shouldn't. And people go, "Wow, I didn't realize there's like a literal Nazi on this show." And then people go, "Well, if you could be paid a million dollars to kill somebody, consequence free, would you do it?" And everybody's like, "Hell yeah, no question." <laughs> But, I don't no, think no should be saying think, hey, yeah. yeah. No one said that except me. There were no, there were people, a lot of people in chat that were like, I'd press it in a second. They don't <laughs> actually probably mean that. They're doing internet stuff. I think it's just the perfect like microcosm of modern society. It's like if you insult a snack food and my lifestyle, who are you to judge? Then it's like, <laughs> oh, you're telling me I can get like a million dollars to kill somebody? Capitalism, of course. You'd be stupid not to. I mean, what if you gave a migraine to the next Hitler, you know? <laughs> <laughs> then, then, you know, you never yeah, know what will happen. That's a question, Rob. That is a great really. question, actually. <laughs> Whatever helps you sleep at night. No points. <laughs> Josh, you alright here, man? Wow. What you got this button. down? Thank you as well. <laughs> there are several billion people. One less makes no change. It makes no change on the census. It makes a huge change to, like, that person's family. Yeah, I mean, you affect yeah, lots really of people by doing it. Up Rob, if you think of people called? as a number. Every every life is important. What? What's that thing called? As a Murph. Oh, it's a Murph. Why Why is it a Murph? Interstellar. Yeah, Interstellar. Who's Murph and Interstellar? You haven't seen Interstellar? I've seen Interstellar, I just don't remember Murph. How could you not remember uh, Murph? She's... Daughter. Oh, fuck. He her says her name Murph? like 55 She's times. the Murph in the Murph movie. She, she is Murph in Murph movie. I, I, you guys are still not making any sense to me. I don't understand. What, <laughs> how, uh, can you name two, one character from Interstellar? Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> and what was his character's name? That's not his character. George. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> you got George. George. George Glass. <laughs> George. George. I just came back. What's what's happening? Oh, Jesus! Hold on. What if there was a fifty percent chance the person would die? I still wouldn't push it. Wait, you what was would. it? I wouldn't. I think you would. What did I uh, unmute? Yeah, I did. You like long odds, though. I know that much about wow. you. Well, I just think like you're still like a pretty terrible person. Like you're gonna push the button yeah. and be like, "Well, it was fifty-fifty. Sorry." <laughs> like. Look, there's even a selfish reason to not push the button, and that's that this is such a weird and unnatural situation to find yourself in, that what if this is some kind of fucked up Saw game, and then the fact that you picked it and it's like a moral decision comes back to haunt you in another way. 
Well, don't I mean, block my know, shooter. You, you gotta assume that it's gonna, you know. Why would you assume that there's no ill will involved with killing somebody with a button for a million dollars? Yeah, well, I mean, haven't you seen the movie the, the Button? <laughs> what is happening there? What the fuck? Oh, don't go in there. Yeah, you gotta watch out for the Murph pit. <laughs> don't go in there. <laughs> That looks crazy. That's oh, tiny. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> it's a tiny so little dumb. solar system. Yes, yeah, it's the orbit of the solar system. It's beautiful. Wow. You got post mortem again? <laughs> Who? You did. Nah. -uh. Will you did? There's Howard another Chad. level. Thank you. No, if, I got that from before. I didn't get it any. Places. What if you kill someone guaranteed, but the money you get from from killing the person could be used to save thousands of other lives? A AKA yeah. like all money. That's on what I mean. Earth. Yeah, okay. Yeah, if you spent it in a way that was actually reasonable. Well, I mean, then that that takes it to like a utilitarian debate more ah! than anything else. So then, <laughs> then it no, then it becomes more like, do I want that to be my responsibility? Yeah, oh my god, right. that's like the yeah. hell on earth. Oh, shit. Yeah, don't go over there ever. Cheer one thousand. Oh, sorry. Cheer ah! <laughs> I love Rob with the delayed mic thing. Man, that's hell over there. It it's is. perfectly angled. I'd push the button if I could get my sweet DX Racer back. Oh. <laughs> I took away my DX Racer. Yeah, I just, I hit the button, made it go away. Oh, no. I, I put a Goldie down. down. Honestly, like, I don't want to mess with, that's what you glued? It's for, <laughs> it's for later. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> we have to put the moratorium on gluing stationary objects, man. <laughs> I really like doing it, though. <laughs> that is an amazing oh, arrow direction. Yeah, it's really oh, good. Oh, fuck. Yeah, that is like. That's amazing. Dangerous. You gonna oh, go sorry. that way? You're gonna go through door path? I'm blocking the ah! elevator. Ah! <laughs> if you could Actually, pay a million dollars to save somebody's life. Would you do it? I think yeah. that, I really. Yeah, I mean, for, I mean, if I had a million dollars, but like, it, that's all your money—a million dollars. Yeah, you'd give yeah, all your money to save one person's life. Yes, but let me let me be your moral compass here because okay. you could like already do that, right? If I spend a million dollars to save someone's life, it doesn't have to be a million dollars. You can save somebody's life with like you know a couple grand. You think so? I use this on this on this thing. Oh, this is gonna turn into a really gross conversation very quickly. <laughs> nice. You blew up my Barbara. I did. Fuck your Barbara. Wires. <laughs> there we go. What if you get a hundred thousand and give a heard, <laughs> give a random person an orgasm? I'm pretty sure there's like no actual consequence to doing that. Wait, you guys all made it? Wow. If I get a hundred thousand oh, dollars and somebody gets an orgasm, what's the downside there? Yeah, that sounds great. What if the person was a woman? Right, what if the person is the next Hitler? <laughs> <laughs> what, if, what if they had a migraine and this killed them? <laughs> oh yeah, it could be somebody like in the middle of open heart surgery and they got exactly. An orgasm. <laughs> 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 that, that would be and a finger curls. On but the <laughs> What if that open heart surgeon was operating on the next Hitler? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Brad, that was amazing. If you give thank Hitler you, an you. orgasm, does that make you worse than Hitler? Yes. Think about it. <laughs> that definitely doesn't. There's, there is no situation in which that is true. <laughs> no, think about it, though. <laughs> I don't want you to rush to judgment over this one. Josh, put down another goldie, please. I don't have any more goldies. Do you yeah. have any? No, get one and then put it down. Do you guys still call them goldies, or did you... We've never, them? ever called them goldies. You <laughs> goldie haunts. They They've them. exclusively been coins, but... Oh, wait. That's free! I'm trapped in the door! Here, I'll help you. Thanks. I appreciate that. How do you hold, get up? Hold the door. Oh, <laughs> LOL. You can't make that joke. <laughs> hold the door. Oh, <laughs> the feels. <laughs> I didn't sign the permission slip for this fields ah! trip. <laughs> Posthumous. Thanks for booing me for the Game of Thrones reference chat. I was just testing to see if our Game of Thrones hey. to see if our Game of Thrones uh, defense mechanism worked. That's not right. What is you just gluing things that can't take advantage of the glue? <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, <laughs> fucking Stevie the stammer. Boy. Oh, Stevie. The please. mighty duck man. <laughs> I don't know why I keep hitting the elevator button so Nick can escape. Like, ah, oh, posthumous. Chat, you, I, I want to know why chat like unanimously said they wouldn't save a person's life for a million dollars. Well, because like we face that decision every day. It's just not explicitly in front of us. Like you, no, uh, let's say you got like you know five grand in your bank account. Okay. You walk there's down. There's always somebody's life that needs saving. For exactly. Different you know, there's people you know starving to death. People who need medicine they can't afford. If you gave them that five grand, that would make a huge difference in their lives. Hmm. So you gotta yeah, drop I mean, it wouldn't, it wouldn't now. literally save their. Well, life yeah. Well, I mean, we're all right gonna now. die someday. So like. I'm just saying the the philosophical hypothetical here is that you know 100 percent this person's gonna die if you don't give up the million dollars, and that will for sure save their life. What about like you, people? What people if you starving made them immortal death, for a million dollars? If you made someone immortal for a million dollars? Yeah. Who would you use that on? Oh, I get to choose. Probably like myself yeah. for sure. Yeah, I mean, no, it can't be you. Myself. It's got to be someone else. I'd use it on somebody who would use their power to save me. Oh, that's smart. smart. Somebody gonna call the elevator? Well, why don't you come down and call the fucking elevator? Well, you're, you're closer. <laughs> right. Well, I'm trying to get it. It's just a little tricky down here, you know. Oh no! See? <laughs> oh. Yeah, but that was just because I'm dumb. Wait, what the hell is this flower doing up We can here? make it, we can make it, we can make it. <laughs> Your chat said Steven Stamkos and Danny DeVito would be the <laughs> No! I'm back in here. That's good answers. Good oh, answers. Bose Mortem! Josh, take your time, dude. Take your time, the Murph's gonna bring me back. The Murph is gonna... Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, Where are I'm you done. At? Okay, no, I'm, I'm, I'm dead. Are you I'm sure? just gonna say... Anybody faced with that? Back. Anybody faced with that decision? Use it on me. I'll happily be immortal. <laughs> yeah, we'll that trade tit for tat. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm and it, down, the more dude. people we get, you know, if if we get too many people, that's all right. I'll use it on you. You use it on Rob. Rob uses it on me. Mm -hmm. We'll get like I'll a sweet. Die. We'll get a taunting going. I can't wait till immortal life exists, because then yeah. all, all you fuckers who are like, I think death's a natural part of life. Get ready for that. <laughs> Get ready for that attitude to die out for uh, eternity. Ah! See, oh. it's a little, oh. it's a little tricky don't, up here now. Don't stand there. <laughs> I was under the elevator. Oh. <laughs> I guess oh. it's my turn, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh shit! Three one nine for the five dollar tip. Asked if I've uh, known that Ryan eats potato chip sandwiches. I did know that, and I mean, also I eat them myself. I, I don't quite good. The, let's not slander myself. I don't eat potato chip sandwiches. I will put potato chips on a sandwich. Yeah, no, this still kind of counts as a potato oh, chip sandwich. Sorry, sorry, Rob. I tried. Oh no, 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 that's okay. You actually got the elevator. You just have to survive and then come over here and then go for that. And hey! I'm oh, oh fuck! <laughs> They like squeeze me out, dude. <laughs> All right. No. Oh fuck. This is a good level. Yeah, it's pretty good yeah, actually. All right. It's a bit better than the hay bale one. Making me more. After like one thousand well, years, you'd be so sick of life, you wouldn't want to keep going forever. Yeah, but yeah. like, you then you 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 can outthink yourself so easily because you'd be like, oh, I'm so sick of life, ah. but I can only be sick of life because I'm alive. Yeah. It's that's a true. it's a privilege to even. You know, n know that I hate this. Think about all the cool shit that's gonna be around in a thousand years. Like yeah. how fucking awesome the world's gonna be in a thousand years. Like super diseases that are resistant to all medication. Oh, well, that's possible too. If you look at the world. Honestly, like, I'm I'm world I'm really problems. looking forward to that because I think society's weak and helpless have gotten off too easy recently. <laughs> yeah. Rob, how oh do you fuck. Get there? It's like, gotta, like get past the arrow. We need a rat plague and the bloat flies or whatever. Well, it was like flies. as soon as Josh was like, you know, I'm a little sick today. I was like, you're lucky, dude, because if we lived in like if we lived in a different era, sorry, you'd just be dead. But instead, it'd be oh, we'll just take some Nyquil. You're good to go. Well, yeah, you should you should place it. I want you to place it first so that I because yeah. I, I kind of want to put it over here. There's already one porter though. You know, I'll just place it right here. I'm gonna chance it! <laughs> what? He chanced it and it worked and it didn't work for Josh! I went to hell. Yeah, you have you have to go first, I think. Oh my god. Some of the bullets get wow. sucked through the awesome. porter. <laughs> oh, that's really awesome. Wow. B Bummy that's plays really games. Cool. Thank you as well.
that for a thousand years I might stop procrastinating that time. I mean, you're you're like inevitably you're gonna get rich, right? That that's that's true too. Or you're like, world. if you're poor, you're just gonna be poor forever. Like well, literally forever. until like the heat death I mean, of the universe. Eventually, you have to get rich, right? Like just if you were, if yeah, you're that's the American way. How, how so though? Like. Like if even if you have like like if well wait this if is you blow up the mirror be... you get like oh god it cracks more <laughs> this is assuming... no stop <laughs> this is assuming not everyone's immortal right right okay sure. so like if you just have like a couple things around your house right now in like you know a thousand years they're gonna be if you keep them in pristine condition they're gonna be worth like a lot of money right. Surely. I'm, what things? <laughs> so the idea is like I've been looking around. Yeah, and I, I like I have this bowl, and then in a thousand years I just go on like <laughs> Antiques Roadshow, and they go, "Whoa, that bowl's from like the Trumpian era. That's like an amazing yeah. relic." And then they're just gonna give me like a bunch of money for it. I mean, eventually, yeah. I mean, like if you wait long enough. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! If you have, like if you have a working iPhone in a thousand years, like I'm sure people are gonna be super into that. I'm dead. Isn't it just impossible because the batteries just wouldn't work? Is that really um, the biggest problem with this uh, line of reasoning? Is the, the <laughs> it's the battery of the iPhone. I'm thinking about like the various ways that could go wrong, and yeah, I guess the battery is like one of them. But what if there's no way to power it properly after that long? I still can't help but feel that this is perhaps missing the. the you think so? I, I mean, I mean, maybe. even if you don't, okay, okay. okay. All right, I'm even sorry. If you, even if you don't do you it down. that way. Like, if you put, uh, like, your money in an account that accrues interest, like... What if I put my money where oh, my fuck. mouth is? A.K.A. I mean, you eat can do my that, money. too. I mean, but I, I'm still, like, I'm letting you get away with one shortcut here, and that's that I don't understand why not everybody's immortal in this case. That, well... Flower punched you to hell and You get to be immortal. Right. Not it's anybody else. a lottery. Else. Yeah. I guess, you know, I actually believe in your premise that if you were immortal and nobody else was, you probably would eventually have to get rich. Yeah, like, even if you didn't really try that hard, you're, you're good That's to right. get rich. I mean, as long as you, like, literally you have all the time in the world. So as long as you just went like, you know, hey, I'd like to be rich in like a thousand years, I feel like you should be able to make that happen. Look at how the arrows shoot out! They oh shoot my out god, it went directions. from one to the other! Yeah, I don't like this. <laughs> <That's so cool. gasps> what? But this is also oh assuming, like, you know, like, the whole world is going to be the same in a thousand years. Like, what if the stock market just crashes and, like, instead of there being compound interest, we're all, like, you know, shooting each other in the Arizona desert trying to get gasoline. Like, that, yeah. <laughs> then it, you know, that's pretty fucked up. That was... Well, we gotta, we gotta ride a bicycle every day to get government credits to buy food from a vending machine. I mean, if you, we already Some, windmill, Something about that sounds, like, pretty okay to me. I mean, <laughs> like, you also end up being really, really good at things, right? Like, eventually. Like, if you live like long riding enough. a bicycle every day. I guess so, but, like, level. think about it. Like, if you're 60 years old and you're, like, your grandparents are, like, trying to teach you how to use, like, a smartphone. You're, like, this is crazy shit I've ever seen. Imagine being born in, like, the year 1000 and then your grandkids are trying to show you how to use an iPhone. You're, like, I grew up before we even knew. We just knew that you, like, you put malt in a barrel and bury it and then three months later there's like beer that you can drink and now you're like hey you can communicate with people in you know nairobi kenya immediately all I right feel, i'll do that i feel is like the capital of kenya it is i mean you might have a harder harder time going you know getting through the learning curve but i mean eventually you'll get it i'm sure oh Murph. got all the time to think about it Murph. Two Murphs. We gotta make a Murph tunnel. Murph Absolutely tunnel. true. Murph tunnel up here. Yep. How about this? Wait, can we force us through the pyramid somehow? Like, we'll bomb one of these Oh, things that would be cool. And then yeah. make a maze that goes through the pyramid, so you gotta go there. Well, I mean, there's only- we only have one exit. I know, I said we'll bomb one of them. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Oh, no, 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 I did it wrong! Oh, ah, time fuck. was all wrong. You remember Thank Murph you, now, Josh? The 569 says I, I pressed the button. This is your portion. Appreciate is that it. The, is that the, that's the lady, though, right? Well, it's one of the ladies. Yeah, but like the daughter lady. Yeah, daughter lady. I like daughter lady. Who's daughter lady? Murph. Oh, yeah. Fuck the pyramid, oh, dude. Oh, character's name again? Coop. Coop. Yeah. Coop and Murph. 
Koopa oh, likes one farts. syllable kid names and stuff. Dang old yeah. Koopa Murph. Koopa Murph. Well, who's the who's the other who's the who's the other? He's boy? got another kid. I think his name was like Joe or something. The dang old <laughs> Casey Affleck man. Yeah. Despondent and misanthropic in the wake of certain extinction of the human race. What was the son's name? Something like that. I don't know the son's name, yeah. Nobody remembers him. He wasn't hardly anything in that movie. It's pretty much like it didn't matter at all. He was like the Walter Jr. That yeah, movie. he's like a he's a second secondary character. Uh, excuse yeah. me, who's Walter? It's Jr.? probably tertiary in all honesty. Are you talking about Flynn? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, apparently his name is Pablo. I didn't realize his was name was not Pablo. Pablo. Uh -huh. I can't move. I'm I'm literally I'm like. Oh, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. Sorry about the concept. Quaternary. What do you mean, <laughs> fuck Flynn? What is your problem? Fuck Mary Flynn. He, they hate teenage angst. Why do you hate Flynn? He's got a, he's got actual problems. I mean, wait, I gotta wait, say... You want me to blow up a hole in this container or what? No, actually, don't, because here's... No, 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 don't put that there, Ryan. Oh, right. No, that's fine. Oh, I fun! I didn't listen to anything that you said. <laughs> I, I should have expected to that, do. to be honest. You know what? Fuck you guys. I'm still going through Murphle. Actually, that's a good point. I would rather do Murphle. There's a way. Oh, there's a way. Wow. There's a way. There's a will. So there's a oh, way. Oh, shit, bear. Breaker Day Godot. Bear. Thank you for the subscription. As much as I love it. Breaking Bad, I will say that Walt Jr. slash Flynn is probably... The one main failing of that show. What are you talking about? Well, it's, it's just okay. because, like, he was, he, he initially was a character that was supposed to be sort of, like, he's supposed to, like, you know. Breakfast. Be an example. <laughs> he's supposed to be an example <laughs> of why Walt is pathetic, and then they never really fleshed his character out fully, and he didn't even really get a good <laughs> I'm stupid. so. My problem is that, like, whenever people talk about Breaking Bad, they always shit on Walter White's family. They're like, they whine so much. Yeah, the freaking dad has terminal cancer. He's become a drug kingpin, and their whole house is <laughs> under threat of, like, getting exploded on any daily basis. And then, like, oh, he whines a lot. I know he's got, like, cerebral palsy, and his dad is a drug kingpin, and his life is constantly under threat, but he whines so much. We've all got hard <laughs> lives, man. Just deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when they when they get into the real world, they'll see it's not so bad. All that whining will be for naught. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm put like a little uh, poop out of the Sphinx. Pooping. <laughs> the Sphinx poop. Yeah, it's a little Sphinx poop. Dragon House, thanks for the resubscription as well. Oh, I like that. Sounds like a prefab from Planet Coaster. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah, I botched that one. Whoop. Thank you, Ring Shay, for the subscription. That. And Bellamy Craft MC. So rude, so rude, yet fucked in hell. <laughs> what are you talking? Okay, a lot. Of, I gotta say, a lot of people in chat were like, "I actually agree with you." So I can't play the victim on this one. <laughs> but a lot of people are like, you know, yeah. But like, I get the Skylar went through some stuff, but you shouldn't have to be a bitch about it. What are you? I mean, she like I don't know. I think Skylar's character was pretty good. I all, thought all so I mean, as like, well. Like, I mean, yes, I admit, in, the be in like, the first season, her character wasn't very fleshed out, and she was just kind of there to kind of whine and complain. But then beyond, like, after the first season, her character gets, like, really fleshed out and becomes very interesting, in my opinion. And, like, she's Aww. rude to Walt, who's, like, an asshole a lot. That's true. Like, all yeah, the like, time. all the time, yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, she's... It's like, well, you don't have to be so mean about it. How do you guys well, do that? <laughs> It's like sad to see, but at the same time, most shows would make that character ignore those obvious cues that he's doing something nefarious. Yeah. And that yeah. show didn't, and I like that because it actually casts her as having some intelligence. I agree. Yeah, she was a very interesting character. I mean, that show, made, like, like almost all of the characters in Breaking Bad are, like, really fleshed out and. Stop saying fleshed out, Rob. Yeah, you're all fleshed <laughs> you're out. All talking all about flesh. They're all, they're all fleshy tubes, and you know. All right. I've never not been a fleshy tube. Eh, who isn't these days? It's like a Slim Jim in one of the plastic Whoa. packages. Oop. What are you guys doing? You don't do it like that. You do it like this. You don't want to go and eat a snack like <laughs> that. Oh! 
Oh, you gave me the points and I love it. The snack that sawed your back. Sawfish. Sawfish. Saw Classic. Sawfishy. Sawfish only. <laughs> Bombing the Sphinx, fuck you guys. Fuck you, the Ice Wall. Jabroni was fucking clueless. No, he wasn't clueless. I think he was just blinded by trust. Red light, revved up like a. Don't <laughs> even call Asak Schrader a jabroni. Asak, <laughs> yo, Hank is a great character. Action, I love Hank. when they show that he's like actually dying inside, even though he seems so cool. Like he's in that elevator mm -hmm. and he can't handle anything, and then he opens the elevator and he's like, "Okay, I'm back to me again." Yeah, that yeah. was a good scene. Yeah, it's like when Honestly, Christine Baranski gets on the elevator in The Good Wife Season 4, Episode 3, and she <laughs> sees that Lockhart Gardner lost the 27th floor, and she gets really sad, but then when the door opens on the 28th floor, she's all business again. It's a great moment of characterization. I'm looking forward to when we get to pitch again. the Good Wife DVD box set on the show. <laughs> Fucking Good Wife every goddamn time, dude. Every Good Wife. It's a good show, man. Don't yeah, do it. Don't watch do it someday. It. Don't do it. <laughs> Yo, is that a crack in the Sphinx? Don't even start with this. <laughs> Look very carefully before you say that. They're going to put this in one day, and we're not going to believe them. Oh! oh who, who made the fucking Murph hole, like, untenable? Oh, goddamn. It's actually completely tenable. It's just... what? Well, actually, no, it is. You can... <laughs> Can you do the Murph tunnel still? Oh like, yeah. Oh sure. Oh sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if you wanted to. Hank is what NL is gonna look like in ten years. <laughs> Honestly, the good wife married Walter White though. That's not that bad. She would divorce him in a fucking second. As flawed as Peter Florek is as a character, he's no Walter White. I'll tell you that much. I'm just saying they could be the team of all teams. <laughs> Don't ever try to de-ice my ice wall. <laughs> Turn it into a firewall. Ooh, we nade it. We nade it? I also said we nade Grenada. it. Grenada. Yay! He's not running anymore. Why have I done this? I'm a dingus! Oh. oh. I've been punched. Hunk's a, Hank's a great character. Y'all is tripping. Hunk. Hunk and Hank. Uh, I'm a boob. Because you think oh. at the beginning of the show that he's That's a big boob. <laughs> and yeah. then it turns out he's really smart and really good at his exactly job. Exactly correct. They yeah, he just has a sense of humor, and people never have senses of humor in serious shows. They do a mm -hmm. great bait and switch where you think Hank is like, you know, some dumb, like, hey, uh, Walter, smell my fingers. <laughs> you ever get a taste yeah. of that, buddy? Right? Like, <laughs> then he turns out to be a very, you know, reasonable and accomplished individual. It's a great show. Mm -hmm. It really is. Wow. In my oh, opinion, wow. the best of all time. Okay. No! I baited him. Oh, oh, I really wanted to just go grab Trap it points. before Ryan had a chance. No! Oh, oh, oh Josh. Oh! Ooh. He's done it. Josh, he learned to jump. <laughs> Hell yeah, Josh. Smell my funky. <laughs> oh! Back in the game. Oh, shit. What up? What if it's a uh, moving poop? Mm. Yeah, no. Get out of here, Josh. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> Try it. You Is it controversial won't. that I think Better Call Saul might be slightly better than Breaking Bad, but both are really good? No, that's like the... Um... Where am I going with this one? There's a great metaphor ah. for it. I have this metaphor sense. I know the metaphor exists, but I can't find uh. it. Just give ah. it a second. It's, it's like the people who think Bioshock 2 is better than Bioshock 1. Like, it's not okay. the consensus opinion, but you can make an argument for it. I'm not going to get, like, bitch slapped for saying that out loud, though, right? I don't, think, yeah. so. I don't think so. I think yeah, they're buddy. different shows, though. It's like it's like saying, like, um, like is Arrested Development a better show than Game of Thrones? Like, they're different right. genres, yes. you know? And um, you shouldn't mistake saying that one is good that I mean the other is not good, because I'm saying they're both above the best. Really good shows. Yeah, exactly. I guess I just kind of prefer the comedy of that show a bit more because it's actually a little lighter at times. It's it's definitely a lot lighter. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go quit. Right, that's depressing. <laughs> we're gonna play Quiplash. Yeah, Let's we're gonna quit. go quit. Okay. See, right. Bear said minutes. he's down for uh, for Rocket League too. This is not possible anymore. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we've booked. We booked. 
Should have gotten out of the VR space, motherfucker. <laughs> See you in three like minutes. Bear to do. All booked up. Hilariously, I don't think Bear was in VR. Like two hours ago, I actually saw the Steam alert that he was playing Rocket League. So oh. <laughs> that is actually pretty funny. Wait, what are we playing? Playing Quiplash. Rocket Quiplash. Quip. What's that mean? Was that Austin or Me? Josh trying to sound like Austin? I don't What's think Quiplash? it was either of those things. Hi, I'm Austin. I don't know I how to. It was just Austin. Josh being Josh. Yeah. Cheer fit. <laughs> Every time. Gets me every time. You gotta tell him to press it like wow. a whole second before you start. JV1696, yeah, thank you as well. Let's see if this. <laughs> My webcam works anymore. Thanks, yeah, Rich, yeah, for the that, $5 that tip. Says Nick, you're awesome. Thank nope. you. Nope. Yeah, it works. I know I missed some subs earlier. I'll go back and read everybody off at the Why? end. Why? Because I think it's just a nice thing to do. Yeah. Oh, mm. But I didn't want to just trample over the whole conversation. You should have. I would have. Yeah, I just don't want it, though. I'm going to play you Spelunky know. for a while. Josh. Hey, Speaking what's up? of Spelunky. Oh, oh hey! Ooh. <laughs> Look at this guy. That's, That's actually intro. great timing. Yeah. What's up, Mike? I really thought you were Bear Tavi for a second. <laughs> Could be if you want. Wait, Wait that what? wasn't Bear? I know! Was, that wasn't it's Bear? It's Bananasaurus Rex. That's Bananasaurus Rex. Oh, shit, I'll be Rex. Rex. Oh I haven't God. been on a call with this guy in like freaking a year now. Yo, yeah, that sounded exactly like. Were you doing a bear impression? <laughs> no, how no, dare it just you? Just sounded like him. Wait, my you own person. weren't doing a bear impression. You sounded just like. <laughs> you literally were a bear. <laughs> you were the bear. Hey, what website do I have to go for this? It's... Jackbox oh. TV. Yeah, I'm glad you asked. Once now, was Josh... that Austin? Yeah. I was no. curious also. Josh, Josh I had a week. question for you. <laughs> yeah. How many questions are there? Oh. Why are we asking? Are we at... I wish that we had to ask that question still, but Ryan doesn't like fun. Wait, so it's quiplash.us? <laughs> yeah, that's it. Oh, wait, no, no, it's Jackbox. It's, it's in the gungeon. Enter the gungeon.com slash Josh. Yeah. No, 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 not .com. In the gungeon slash Josh. Oh. I, sorry, I was I was distracted by how many B Rexes there were in the chat. Where do I go? <laughs> so I was at least yeah. two and a half B Rexes. I was distracted by how many B Rexes were in the call. Yeah. Oh. Because at first I thought it was zero B Rexes, one bear, and then it turns out I was incorrect. See, what's, we were. Yeah. I thought it was bear. What's the uh, what's the room name? There is no uh, room name. I need a room name though. No, you don't. We talking can about it, can it be Pyre again? Remember when it was Pyro? No, that wasn't Kate's stream when it was Pyro. Re read the, this read the from prompts on the wow. screen. This Wait, is what Project Jackbox looks TV, like. Room code. Yeah. I need a room code. Correct. Yeah, that's what I meant. What did I say? Yeah. Room name. Sitting room name. Yes, this, uh, you knew what I was saying. <laughs> don't pull that, that, <sighs> that shit with me. Alright, hey, alright, 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 alright. I'm gonna pull your shit out of your butt with my hand. Josh, I got it. <laughs> Josh, you go to PAX East this year? I'm going to PAX South this year. You're going to PAX, PAX South East? this year? Hell yeah. Dude, I could drive to PAX South. You should. Yo, apparently the next TwitchCon might be in uh, New York. Whoa. Yeah. Let's we'll see about that. Who wants to go to New York? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Kristen and I are going down for PAX South. Yo. One. It's gonna be I'm just saying. If TwitchCon is in New York, you all should go, and so I then we're gonna go to all Portland. The... <laughs> no. I'm just gonna get a bear. Yeah, I'm gonna go hang out. Let's go to the bear's house. <laughs> every every pack, let's go to bear's house. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I plan on doing. You guys know is this that like now working Chrome? Debated? It should work in Chrome. No, it works in Chrome. It only works in Chrome, Chrome for me. Oh, did I get the... Oh, I got the code. I didn't even realize. Wait, so it only works in Chrome for Nick, but it only works in Firefox. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like... Sounds That's like... Makes sense. It only works in Chrome, Firefox. Or Safari, or Internet Explorer, even Edge. Netscape? Netscape. Edge? Yeah, oh, Netscape. Earthly? Was that a double, was that a yeah, double Netscape reference? A double, yeah, that was a double Netscape. Double Netscape. Well, how are you gonna fucking We're cut from the same cloth. Right? Is what does that mean? It means we're both circumcised. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, what? <laughs> it's gonna be one of those shows, huh? Yeah. 
Right. Yeah. What are you talking about now? Circumcision. It's over nice. Not gonna All be right. ready for circumcision. B Rex, don't. I know you're kind. Okay, don't try to speed run this game. <laughs> we need to get an hour out of this game, so don't be doing any speed running on my watch. Okay. It's okay. I haven't speed ran anything in like a year, so. You gonna is that gonna race and buck your hair? The fastest <laughs> amount of time anybody is not speed run anything in one year. <laughs> For Christ's sake. All right. I do other things, you know. I'm starting the game. Uh, no. I get, oh. I get the room code for the chat? Yeah. You can, you can take can I get a code. room code, please? You can put the room code on the screen for, uh, for chat. Can the room code in the room chat code. screen? Josh, what's somebody the room just code? say it out loud so I don't have to go back to Discord. Don't worry. Um, EGVF. Yeah. EGVF. Here you go, Excellent chat. Excellent girls. Very fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that they are. That's pretty good. It's not bad. This I like it. Round have you played Quiplash before, uh, B Rex? I have, yeah. Okay. Not Quiplash 2, though, whatever that is. Oh, it's, no, this is it's exactly, the exactly the same game. Occasionally, you may have to look at my screen. Yeah. Or Austin will screen cap it and put it in Discord. Yeah. yeah. Alrighty. Or just explain it to us, too. I could also yeah. try that, I suppose. Yay! Uh, okay. Oh, I forgot I gotta be funny now. Well, it's never stopped us before. <laughs> it doesn't really say how much time we have on our screen, does yeah, it? Yeah, that's have correct. about a minute and a half for two prompts. Okay. Ryan will let us know when it's like done. I try to, yeah. Ooh. That game is so fucking hard. <sighs> Alright, I think both of mine are bad. <laughs> I mean, I do, but, you know, it's round one. They're Ooh. gonna be bad. They're all gonna be bad. I just wanna at least get, like, one half of a round before we go off the deep end. Yeah. <laughs> it's not I great. need more time to We're get good. ready for this. We're good. I'm, I'm fully, <laughs> fully loaded. 35 seconds remaining. Are you Herbie fully loaded? Yes. Chivy. <laughs> you're, ch Herbie. you're Chivy fully loaded? I'm like a baked potato. I, I was so afraid it would run out of time, I just put it in whatever. Yeah, it's good, it's better than not putting stuff in, and then it just gives 100 points to whoever said Dan Giesling. Yeah, I was just gonna say, I heard I can just put Dan Giesling from, from everybody when they heard I was gonna be on this. It's a That's delicate a game! Huh. Really if works. I see one Dan Giesling, I'm out of here. You got five seconds! That's a real problem. It's bad, but I'm in. It's bad, but I'm in. <laughs> Alright. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're not Let's good, start we're good. Show. Okay. Starting us off, a movie that needed more nudity Aladdin or Pokemon. <laughs> the first movie? Pokemon had a lot of nude Pokemon, so I'm gonna go with Aladdin. Yeah. You know what? You kind of swung me on that one. <laughs> I mean, and also, another one to swing on is like in Pokemon, like all the main characters are like 13. That's. Yeah, but I mean, in Aladdin, for me. Rob, all right? you want to know if Jafar's packing, right? Exactly, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> you know he's not. I well, know, you know that he is people because would, like, if see he was, Misty. he would use his wish to, for, to pack a big dong. That's a good point, yeah. <laughs> well, that was uh, a quiplash for Aladdin. Welcome to the show, yeah! BX. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Throw out my fire. Like I said, not a good start. I, I thought it was okay. <laughs> <laughs> How Matthew McConaughey stays in shut, such great shape, probably. Murph, turf, burf. <laughs> or he he does the chest thing from the Wolf of Wallster. Wallster. <laughs> Wallster. I think it might be uh, Ryan running out of room. I think it might be. This uh, is not me. It's oh, an abbreviation okay. for strength, maybe. <laughs> wall strength. Wolf of wall yeah. strength. Wall strength. The Wolf yeah. of Wall strength. All right. I voted yeah. for it twice. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So strong. That's uh, another quiplash. This time for Rob. <laughs> <laughs> he does the chest yeah, thing from sure. Wolf of Wallster versus <laughs> Murph Turf Burf. <laughs> I thought Murph Turf Burf would be good. Battle of the Ages. Isn't that Battle of the Ages? Why? Why was the Burf an eye, John? That's a good point. What? You, the Burf had an eye in it, not you. Happy I don't birthday. Know, welcome to birth. Yeah, how dare you. It's the <laughs> weirdest event for which to camp out the night before. The Northern Lion Live Super Show or in hindsight Star Wars Episode 1. 
<laughs> oh, that's pretty clever. I like that's that. That's really yeah. good, yeah. And it's probably Ryan's. Fuck. <laughs> you guys, Ryan's uh, I don't care you guys flatter me too much. I almost clicked the NLSS one, but then I realized it would only win because it's about the NLSS. That's a good yeah. point. As a self-fulfilling prophecy. Mm. Ah, it did win, even though uh, all, all of you guys voted for uh, my answer. Burf, burf, burf. Uh, Northern Lion Lab Super Show. <laughs> Super Show. <laughs> A nutritional fact you'd find on a can of whoop ass. This is the greatest prompt I've ever seen. Stone cold approved or serving size you. This is this is a great prompt. Yeah. I need help deciding what to pick. Uh, pick stone cold. No, don't do that one. Pick serving size you. <laughs> That's how all elections should be decided. <laughs> yeah. You pick this. <laughs> I said it first. Yeah. It's Ser nice to be in that answer. <laughs> Serving size you. 63 to 37. Yeah! That's good. Did I get a quip? Thanks to Stone Cold voters. Not a quip. Not a quip. Uh, uh, Josh stole your quip. <laughs> Josh stole your quip. It's so cold. I can't not vote so cold. That's it's better than me. So. The worst thing to say during your Oscar award speech. Thanks or thanks for the Emmy. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't someone walk on stage and no just vote. say thanks one time? Who was that? <laughs> that like they said, they said thanks and they just left. Um, or was, that, was that like an Emmy or something? I don't know. I think it was like Johnny Depp or something. I freely Eddie DiCaprio. Just read this as the oh. best thing to say. <laughs> it was actually Eddie Murphy's acceptance speech for Norbit. <laughs> oh, that was the Schlosker, is that? <laughs> oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> that was, uh... I would have put no thanks. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for the Emmy. Got a, Savage. Got a quiplash. You, you get my, uh, my spiritual the vote for... the opera is so moody. <laughs> What's the real reason the Phantom of the Opera is so moody? He's got all them teeth but no toothbrush. <laughs> or have you seen his fucking face? <laughs> He's got all them teeth. No Apparently, toothbrush. it was Joe Pesci who did it for Goodfellas. Oh, oh really? He just walked up and he was just like, thanks and like... Thanks. That's, that's, was that your Joe Pesci? Thanks. Uh, <laughs> it's really hard to cultivate an impression on a single word. <laughs> thanks. Especially of Joe Pesci. Like, thanks. Yeah, thanks. I'm doing a shoulder thanks. thing, too. Thanks. Yeah, are you doing, are you thanks. putting the, the one finger up with, uh, the, with the thumb? Yeah. You know, doing thanks. That, yeah. Yeah, I am thanks. doing that. Have you seen his fucking face one, despite getting none of the votes from you guys, so. Round <laughs> the audience is, uh, <laughs> this is a wow. wild game. Yeah, it has protest votes from the audience. Why? It was good. I liked it. That's why I made it. It was good. We got a lot of, like, meme points here. Like, Josh has 420. <laughs> Very nice. Do I have zero? Yes. Yeah, okay. You weren't the first. No, Mouth was the first person. Zero. Yeah, you're not You're not the first zero. Actually, Mouth has been zeroed, like, three times. So <laughs> you're still good for now. Oh... Oh, I got to. I have to. No. Oh, I have to. <laughs> I absolutely have to. Mm. No one's. No one's. Gonna get it. Very few people will get it, but I did it anyway. I feel like my answers were a little better that time, but I'm not confident. You're in so quickly. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta go with your heart. He's just, he's speed running it. It's happening. <laughs> Thank you, Prom Squad Josh, for the three months resubscription. And Pam the Yam for the eight months. I've had too many times playing this game where I ran in the time, so. Yeah. I just get anxious and put in answers immediately. It's the speedrunner instinct, man. <laughs> Can't help it. <laughs> in case you didn't realize VRX is speedrunner, that's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Solid, I'm gonna say solid five out of ten rounds. Any round, I, I said this, I think I said this last time. Any round where you don't meme, that's a good round. Hmm. I, I hate this. <laughs> B Rex is gonna annihilate me. Actually, I'm like a two out of ten here as well. Yeah, um, alright, good. Okay, that's okay. Moment of truth. 
Up first. Wow. When you read it, let me say it, alright? Let me say it when you read it. Red no, no, like, read it, but then I'll read it. Alright. The hardest clown you can take it, clown college. Hunting people what? in the night. What? <laughs> the clown? You're taking hard clowns? The hardest class. The hardest clown? You can take a clown college? Give both slides. I think he'd be pretty hard. <laughs> the hardest class you can take at clown college. You can take any clown. Apologies for that. Hunt, hunting people in the night, or yeah. hey, get your ass into this small car. How can we even vote after that? Right. <laughs> I just would feel bad if I chose the hunting one. The hardest clown. <laughs> well, hunting people in the night wins. It wins. It wins. Not by much, but it wins. Can Wait, I get? Is Slice dead? Yes. Oh no. What? I didn't know that. Oh yeah, he died. Okay. Okay. Here we go. A great yeah. name for a meteorologist, <laughs> Joe Blowhard or Arthur. Then I don't wow. need a jacket. <laughs> Going for the dead man answer. With that, I guess. <laughs> Wait, what's the jacket one? It's the one where Arthur, the meteorologist, goes pretty much everywhere. It's going to be hot. Stala. <laughs> and then the lady goes. Yeah, exactly. I don't know what that means. Can it's I a get your Photoshop pictures of hard clowns for today, by the way. Nick. Ah, uh, you're. Bodied clowns, hard no, body. You're getting, but you know what you just said. Oh, you said I don't want Wait, Nick, Nick's one, Nick one's hard clown. Don't put yeah, those kind of hard, hard clowns, clowns on the Reddit. Nick's you're gonna get in trouble. Don't do it. Could wow. you send Nick all your Joe. pictures of hard clowns? <laughs> Joe no. Blowhard has won that. Nah. Uh, a rejected. Pro tip: If your answer is a reference, I'm probably not gonna vote for it. <laughs> yeah. A rejected, less scary title for the movie Jaws: Shark, Bob. Shark Time movie game or The Old Man and the Sea. I'm gonna vote for it, but I'm Fuck. angry. <laughs> You're dead right. There's no way. B Rex, it's a reference. A it's a reference. I voted Old Man and the Sea. Thank you, Josh. If old man C wins, I will just. I toe on hard clowns. <laughs> wait, wait, why oh, is, yeah. is old man C a meme now? No. Shark Time movie game is a, is a meme. Oh. The old man in the sea wins 53 to 47. Wow! Yeah. Close game. Sure, the the game. game. You guys get out ahead and, and uh, shooting down the memes. Showcase. The weirdest talent a beauty pageant contestant could showcase. Neatest labia or showcasing <laughs> maps and such. Is that a reference to Miss South Carolina 2007? Yes. Who says <laughs> not? Fifty percent. Fifty percent of U.S. Americans don't have maps. <laughs> so the maps of Africa and such. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that poor uh, lady. I'm not gonna vote. That poor, oh, poor, stupid <laughs> lady. Such as U.S. and the South Africa. <laughs> <laughs> well, neatest labia. 61 to 39. Yeah, awesome. Yeah, to my labia fans out there. I, I'm still I'm happy, happy with my answer. I guess so. <laughs> Something. <laughs> Sorry, thanks for the sub. Rob oh. laughs like Elmo. Great stick for you. Something in 98% of all cargo pants pockets. Pockets or pocket sand? Is that a reference to comedian John Pinsetti? Pinset? John Pinset? Pinsetti? Pinsetti? Uh, I don't even know who that is. Ryan, are you okay? Uh, yeah. <laughs> the building fire. You see birds? <laughs> it's uh, from uh, King of the Hill. Carlos Mencia? Ryan's on like an extended flirtation right now. <laughs> Pocket sand is again. one. Re return the yeah. uh, Turn it. It's a quip. Sand. It's a quiplash as well. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why? Rex, do you have zero points right now? I I don't know. Shut up. A hit <laughs> I don't know. Shut up. A hit country song for people who care about the environment. Oh shit. I'm green for you, or my goal is coal. Yeah. I like how it ends in old okay. twice. Um, yeah. Me. I had to vote for that one. I swear to God. <laughs> Somebody better vote for me. <laughs> my, my, for my goal is coal. My goal is coal. That's that's a really really strong good. answer. Yeah. Please. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> it quit flashed. Oh, this is not what 
what I expected. <laughs> it's good though. You've gone so far. You've come out the other side now. This yeah, time, so. that's amazing. <laughs> oh my oh, god. god. Oh. Well, at least you're guaranteed points on the last lap. Yeah. Well, no, if you get zero votes or like less than like one percent, right. you will get zero. Okay. Votes. Really? Yeah. I've seen it happen on my stream last weekend. I, I heard you got a super quiplash as well. Yeah, that is super quick. I think it's ninety percent plus. Yeah. When Malf got zero, was for, was it for the whole game? No. Or? No. It was only one. Oh, round. <laughs> Come up with a shocking newspaper headline with this word in its title. Wart. Don't, don't do it. Uh, uh. Uh. Mm. All oh. right, I'm I accidentally hit enter instead of delete. So <laughs> I'm way too mildly offensive. Happy. I'm way too happy with my Here answer. Me. I hate my answer, honestly. I, I'm too I have happy. No idea how to feel about mine. Mentos man, thank you for the. I'm being moved at the first place. All right. Breaking: Hulk Hogan has warts on his balls. <laughs> Swarthy YouTuber named world's sexiest man. You'll never guess where Hillary's new wart is. Wart's the matter with your genitals. <laughs> Evil Mastermind's plan thwarted once again. Warder shortages lead to rampant typos. <laughs> Just one nah. vote. Just one vote. Just one vote. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one. Was yours about the YouTubers? No. Oh god. Dude, these are this might be like one of the best last lashes we've ever had across the There's board. There's a lot of clever ones here. Yeah. Yeah, this is almost like we're actually doing the points show. <laughs> <laughs> I should have did Ward exclamation point. What is it good for? <clears throat> yeah. Okay, oh. we're taking home some medals. Staple. Yeah. It looks Here's like the silver. It's gonna be between Austin and Nick. What's oh, trans over? Okay, sixth, job, Rob. Austin. Fifth, me. Fourth, Josh. Third, B Rex. Second, Austin. First, wow. Nick. Oh, oh shit. That's it. Let's GD. take a look at the first. Well, there goes my first. Where'd it go? Yeah, Nick's uh, gonna take it here. Yeah. That was a solid. I'm oh, thank cool. goodness. You <laughs> solid too, buddy. You, you didn't just not get, uh, or you didn't, you didn't just get a vote. You got third. I should have just put the worst thing possible to become a Wait, meme. you went from sixth place to third place? No. Oh, no. Okay. No, I'm still last. <laughs> did I do? It's tough to come back from Tuesday. Yeah. <laughs> did I do well, Ryan? You did okay. I'm Schmitty, and you know like, how okay? I'm okay? I mean, you didn't come in last. Yeah. Did I come in this. second to last? I didn't really look, honestly. In? I think you came in second, you actually. Do. Yeah, you might Ryan, did second. I come in second? I don't know. Did you come in non-B-Rex well, last? <laughs> You can't really come in last. The better your score. If I'm Let's go. Mm, I don't know. It doesn't matter. It's all good. A sign that your dog is an idiot. Oh, Ryan, we're. <laughs> <laughs> then I don't need a jacket. <laughs> Ryan, are you okay, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Calm before the storm. My first one's really bad. You got the uh, 35 <laughs> seconds left here. Uh, let me see the key. What are you playing, Spelunky? Spelunky. That's a game. Yeah, I missed it. I haven't played it in like a year or so. How's, here I am. How's the most recent expansion? I wish there was more Spelunky. It's a good game. It's a great game. They should add like a heaven. 
<laughs> in Spelunky. Yeah. Because there's like a hell. But I'd be fine with there just being three, like three seconds. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> oh, <laughs> like, oh hilarious. No. I love panic. Oh fuck. Dude. Question: no, Does it tell practice. them if you went for a safety quit? Yeah. It does <laughs> after. 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 Yeah. Yeah. After it does. <laughs> a sign that your dog is an idiot. Pick this one to spite wow. Ryab or can't look up. I don't doing it. trust him. Amen. Oh, you're right. It was him. Despite, Ryan. Amen. Was break. It. Thanks for the subscription. Was it? Do not trust him. Do you think I'd reveal my master plan if there was any chance you could mess it up? I submitted <laughs> the prompt 30 minutes ago. Did I get fucking played like a fiddle dude? <laughs> fiddle dude. Please no. It was Ryab, so I was like, oh, that's Josh. That's gotta be Josh. Pick this one to spite Ryab. 70% to 30%. Thanks for the points, guys. Oh, Fuck. It wasn't me. I'm so <laughs> fucking mad right now. The wrong thing to say after farting in church. The wrong right. thing to say after don't farting in church. Amen. <laughs> or sorry, I took it pretty hard up there. Ooh. <laughs> Hmm. That's a dark one. Why did they take it pretty hard up there? Yeah, are they, are they talking about heaven? <laughs> Who's going to be the one to explain there? this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you see, in the early 2000s, there was a scandal with the Catholic Church, and uh, <laughs> sorry, I took oh. it pretty hard up there. 52 to 48 percent. Wait, that's I that won. movie that The Incredible Hulk was in. Yeah. Uh, yeah the out. Avengers. Yeah. The yep. Hitler gave to his mustache. <laughs> the it was all a metaphor. <laughs> the nickname Hitler gave to his mustache, probably. Quesadilla breath, or my mustache in Waffelstein. <laughs> oh, that's just racist. Now that you okay. said it with that accent, I went literally. for a safety quip, but I don't, I don't know what it gave me. If it was quesadilla breath, I swear. <laughs> it awful. definitely was. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the safety quip, sir. <laughs> Tough to win I could have put anything in there and it would have been better than that. <laughs> I'll never make that mistake again. Yep. You did indeed get quesadilla breath. And then oh you got whiplash. I couldn't think of anything. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually a super quiplash as well. Oh no! Oh god! <laughs> do we have to kill him now? Like, <laughs> <laughs> the, what the hell? The top pop song of 1906. I'm thankful for her ankles. Or man, I like riding this horse. That's a great <laughs> song. <laughs> I'm thankful for her ankles. Oh man. <laughs> the best part if is that said ankles, I would have done it. With the safety quip, you get half of the points anyway. So they really just have <laughs> they have super zero. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. I'm thankful uh, for her ankles. 65 to 35. Damn. I really want to know what the tune of Man I Like Riding This Horse is. I think that could work. Man. <laughs> I think that could work this year. Riding this horse. What Sonic and the Hedgehog. What Sonic the Hedgehog <laughs> would trade all of his gold <laughs> rings for? <laughs> to be a toilet for knackles again for an hour. Oh god. Or man. wet dog smell. <laughs> what? What? Oh, this, this question is like designed to short circuit the language centers of your brain. <laughs> what the hell? Nick. Sonic and a hedgehog. <laughs> Nick. I, I, what do you want from me? I just want you to know that I safety quipped on this one too. That was <laughs> that was a safety quip, and you got 19% of the vote. <laughs> See, people just want Sonic to be a toilet again. <laughs> Make Sonic a toilet again. I got a vote. <laughs> the worst got... part about having your human brain living in a robot body. <laughs> Assimilating with the Borg, or there is no bad part, I-A-I, funk fa. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Bro, Rob. <laughs> I'm going to go with funk <laughs> Sure. Not, Rob mashing his keyboard. That doesn't sound answer. like, you know, Rob. Better not fucking win. <laughs> I voted for it. I vote Come for on. Wall Street. 
please. Sorry. <laughs> Don't <laughs> give chat ammunition. <laughs> It won. No. Yeah. It, it won 55 to 45. Oh. I'm not surprised at all. I'm sorry. Of a meme. I, uh, I, I, well, everybody uh, get the spelling right for I A I Fank Fa. <laughs> it is time it will be canonized. Mark it down in the books. <laughs> yep, I'll see you on uh, the end of the circle, Jerk. Yep. Oh, fuck. But now we just need to, like, make a robot somehow accidentally, and then they'll put that picture with IAI <laughs> Fangfa under what it. What the fuck? IAI Christ is this prompt? <laughs> that was Bucky. This. <laughs> this is a strange prompt, I agree. I think I, I got your prompt, Nick. Yeah. Very strange. <laughs> Thank you, Kenya Stu, for the very generous $25 tip. Hmm. What the fuck is this? So what is the end? What is the path here for this prompt? Where do you go? I'm kind of giving up a little. Uh, I mean, Nick, if I write Ia Fongfa, will you write Ia Fongfa? <laughs> no, I won't write that. Ia, Ia Fongfa. Uh, good old Ia Fongfa, yeah. <laughs> Good stuff. Ooh, this sucks, dude. That one's All right, there you go. Best there. I got. How much time do I have? Thirty seconds. This is a recent <laughs> prompt. <laughs> I'm about like a one out of ten right now. Almost out of time. Use the safety quick button. I'm really okay. happy that my mashing of the keyboard ended up with like words that are pronounceable, like they have vowels in them. Twelve I, I, I seconds. Well. Time Both of my prompts deal. were extremely Number specific and list. extremely and strange. Beep beep boop boop. A good I, sign. I, 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 <laughs> a good <laughs> sign. Your dog wears your clothes when you're not home. They smell like your dog. Or he asks if you'd fuck him, he'd fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's pretty clever. I like that. That is really, I like that as well. <laughs> took something very benign and made it kind of clever. Yeah. I was even talking about Silence of the Lamb in the stream today. It's a great movie. It is. Very it deliberately is. paced, but still has something for the whole family. Yeah. <laughs> it's mostly a kid's movie, honestly. Yeah, it's true. So I don't like it, watching it, movies with animals. Like, I, I I, don't know what it is. Silence of the Lambs? I've you heard, heard of it, it but I've not, like, I don't know anything about it. It's a movie he's about another, an animal. He's another me. He doesn't watch movies. Yeah, I was going to say, now you oh sound like God. Austin. Yeah, I don't. Like, as soon as you talk about movies or music, I'm just, like, completely lost. Well, that explains why you were confused about this one. The advice a couple's therapist would give to Captain America and Bucky. <laughs> Have you tried yoga, or try not to put up an emotional shield? <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, good. <laughs> I didn't feel great. I didn't feel great about voting for it, but it had to be done. Please. No, I think you, I think you got it, Rex. I think you finally took it. Oh, thank goodness. Maybe. I did what I needed. Yeah. No, oh I, yeah. Sure. I voted for emotional shield. Yep. Yeah, that was a heck of a quick flash there. Oh, but I did it! I did it, Dad. But you quit blast someone else! Yeah, it's me. No. Oh, the curse has been yeah. passed on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. Austin, have you ever seen Silence of the Lambs? I've seen the second half of it, weirdly enough. Yeah, me too. Okay. Well, that's, how does that happen? How do you walk yeah, in yeah, halfway? It's a TV movie, man. It's a TV, and it's it's a TV movie. Like, yeah, here's the thing. A good name for a mint for your butt. Mint for your butt or shit mints. <laughs> I, I think mint for your butt is actually weirdly enough a good name Come for on. mint for your butt. No, like uh, le legitimately, like how are you gonna disguise what that is? So like <laughs> figging? There's only what? one way to, to explain the truth. Wait, what is figging? <laughs> when you put a what? little slice of shaved what? fig up your ass. Wait, wait, wait you put are you guys a... even talking to me? Where did this conversation go? <laughs> that's not a thing. <laughs> you put a slice no, of shaved fig in don't their ass. Me. But why? why? They, figs in their ass? they make that's it tingle because they simulate your nerve centers. There's a ton of uh, nerves in your asshole. Dude, you put why? figs in there? Well, why would a fig be good? It's, it's what it does. It why, tingles. Why not like anything else, though? <laughs> <laughs> it tingles. <laughs> 
I have to wonder about this guy sometimes. Okay, <laughs> a sign they should put up on the Florida state line. Florida, the Florida of America, or welcome to hell. <laughs> which which of the buttments won? Uh, I, I know, I was, too, I was worried about figging first. It's actually <laughs> ginger, I'm sorry, I was wrong. It's ginger, not fig. Oh, you put ginger in your butthole. Well, you should have said that. That yeah, makes yeah, a lot more sense. Yeah, yeah it's it's okay. Nick is so dumb. <laughs> 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 Florida, the Florida uh, of America, 62% or so. At least I didn't get quit last year. A good nickname for went with a pretty safe answer there. A good the nickname hell? for Wolf Blitzer, Grandpa News Nuts, or Blitzen Trapper. <laughs> what? The Grandpa News Nuts. Wolf Blitzer is the one of the lead anchors on CNN. Correct. Uh, I think. Uh, when you said lead, you meant to say worst. <laughs> yeah, but like he's like one of the main yeah. anchors, though. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck Mary Kill, Megan Kelly, Wolf Blitzer, Christian Amanpour. Okay, who's the last one? You don't know who Christian Amanpour is? How do you not know Christian Amanpour? It's Christian Amanpour! It's Christian Amanpour! Grandpa News Nuts has, uh. <laughs> Grandpa News Nuts with a, uh. A decisive victory. Yeah. What people in the early 1900s probably said, yeah. when, they the probably said when they got electricity for the first time. Witchcraft, hang it by the neck till wow. dead, or I'm thankful I can see her ankles now. <laughs> <laughs> also, oh. EI Fankfa, thanks for the subscription. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, wow. Donkey! For the 26 months, thank you. I guarantee you that one wasn't notice. taken. I bet you he was typing that in for a split second. It's like, is this ta Oh, no, it's not taken. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember when Wolf Blitzer got wrecked at Celebrity Jeopardy? <laughs> Jeopardy. <laughs> Celebrity <laughs> Jeopardy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like the Jet Li. Oh, the Wolf Blitzer got right, right, like open the window, dude. It's, like, oh, it's really, cool. it is kind of hot yeah, in here, problem. honestly. Get down on my poor. Rob is dominating so hard. <laughs> he has like a 2,000 point lead heading into the final lash. Yeah, I'm terrible at the final lash, though. <laughs> I just love that we have a chat where people can reference specific episodes of Celebrity Jeopardy and then have a reasonable expectation that they'll, you know, get a bite. Jeopardy. <laughs> Jeopardy. <laughs> Come up with a hilarious... <laughs> B-Rex isn't in last. He's in third, yeah. Well, you're in third. Come up with a new <laughs> hilarious sitcom with this word in the title. Sack. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Well, if this doesn't get quiplash, this is good for a top three answer, guaranteed. <clears throat> I am not in top three territory. I'm always so bad at the last lash, honestly. <laughs> this one might as well just be called Put Sack in an existing television show. Yeah, pretty much. I don't know why the last lash is do a pun. Like that's what it is. Yeah, that's that's very true. Uh, <sighs> not proud of that one. <laughs> what's uh, what's the time on it looking like? Yeah, 13 seconds. Oh shit! I don't know what I put. I just want to like get the last lash over with so we can start again and I get two prompts. <laughs> yeah. Here's what everybody wrote. Nope. Nope. Back crack one. and sack waxing. Sackfeld, Jerry's balls strike back. Two and a half sacks, the big sack theory. Oh shit, it's sack, motherfucker. How I met your sack. Back I met prom? your sack. <laughs> Sackfeld, Jerry's balls strike back. What do you think did that one? <laughs> I was thinking I was just doing like Frazier pull and sack. <laughs> yeah, I mean that would be pretty good. good. <laughs> I don't know. I can't peg anybody on this one. Yeah, you They're certainly in... may not. Thank I you. Had I, nothing I, until I you said put you. sack in an existing one. <laughs> <laughs> Two and a half sacks is already the name of the show. Okay, let's bring out. Hey those no, got him. Got him. It looks like. B-Rex is probably going to take this one. 
Great. Hell yeah. Just turn How did the big sack theory come in last? <laughs> so last to first. How did the big well, sack the come in last? Ages. Me, Austin, Nick, Josh, Rob, B Rex. Oh, I retain first. Easy. That is correct. Right, that's it. Time for the final scores. Oh, man. How did I do? Is it the way I said it? The big sack theory? Oh, <laughs> well, I did better that it, time. It lost to. Oh shit, it's sack motherfucker. <laughs> Which doesn't even make sense. <laughs> I was running out of time. Uh, it's top three answer, right? <laughs> For first. <laughs> Almost. Let's play quick. Blind Sniper is 36. Thank you for the Thanks subscription. For joining the party. Can I we get some uh, rack attacks in chat, please? Later. No. Sack attacks, more like. Yeah, sack attack. I like that. Stop. Scary sack <laughs> strikes back. <laughs> EI Faithful! <laughs> Welcome to the patrol. <laughs> it's for you, my friend. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Lynn. Mm. Hi, Lynn. Oh, God, this prompt. <sighs> This is not a good promise. I'm gonna say it. I know I say that a lot, but I'm saying it now. It's a bad promise. Ooh. <laughs> Chris Haste 02. Thank you for the subscription. Did anyone else get the greatest promise? Yes, I think I did. <laughs> I think I lost on Oh God! But what? What <laughs> would he do? I don't know. I'm trying to think of a good one. I'm trying to think of a good one. Fuck! How much time? Twenty-five seconds. How many questions? Two. <laughs> All right. Ian Fangfa, thank you so much for the <laughs> Fourteen seconds left. He set us all up. He's been doing it. Wait, you bro. said that there was less time, but there was actually more time? Four seconds left. Nice. Let's put up those quips. My second one was pretty bad. <laughs> Alvin and the Chipmunks 12. Here's some pitch shifted songs to buy. Or Alvin and the Chipmunks 12, EI Fangfa. Who did it? <laughs> Who did it? We have to stand together. Uh, come forward now. <laughs> oh, Saxon double jam. Saxon the city though. That's not. Oh, it is a TV show. That would have worked. Yeah, Saxon oh, the city would have been pretty good. Saxon the city, yeah. Saxon the city and the silver spoon. <laughs> <laughs> blue and the man on the moon. Ooh. Ooh. Nick gets a like 52% quiplash. Wow! Suck wow. on that shit, Rob. The people yeah, have made a stand. Man, it's All right, over. Fair enough. Yeah, fair enough. it'll never win another quiz again. Never win another quiz last prompt again. No, actually, you know what? I just realized what I am. The next person that uses EI Fangfa is gonna win. Yeah. Now. Like, that's that's what happens. There's you know, all that. you're me. <laughs> you know your house. You know yeah. your house is too big when you have a room specifically for planning what to put in all your rooms, or you have a room specifically for constructing skyscrapers. Rex, is that you? Wait, that's... I don't know. Are you I... in there? It's your scraping <laughs> room? Maybe. Are you in there, B-Rex? Maybe. Are you in there? Yeah. You in there, boys? I knew you would. I voted, so you got a chance to get that vote. You didn't, the though. The second one's pretty good. <laughs> I follow on the Electoral College, though. 71% <laughs> planning what to put in all your rooms. God damn it. Yeah, <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> but a really big room because skyscraper. No, I get it. I, I like <laughs> a good sign that you accidentally married a duck. Did you know ducks have corkscrew penises or she sounds like a real quack? Oh, Jesus. Oh, boy. Real good. Hey, what did the mallard say her. about his wife? She sounds like what? a real quack. <laughs> Are you laughing like a duck right now? Is that what? <laughs> Ducks have no concept of humor. Quack, quack, quack. 
That's a goose. <laughs> That's a great goose. Though. Come That's on. Goose. Did you know oh, ducks have? Goose, no. Did you know ducks have corkscrew penises? Fifty-six to forty-four. Like, wow. Yeah. Good job. Even you don't sense. even have to answer the prompt anymore. Have to do with the prompts. Don't even have to go with it. How a drunk rabbit would embarrass himself. He'd expose his carrot at a party or go down a political rabbit hole. Mm, I feel like I'm about pretty, to get destroyed. They're both okay. Huh. It's the typo, not the quip. Alright, I can accept that. I had two S's on sounds. Uh, uh, Go down a political rabbit hole. Really? 56 to 44. Get destroyed. <laughs> yes. The, the Different <laughs> crowd watching us than usual. It's like a 100% divergence in character. Josh and Rob <laughs> voted for carrot equals penis. And me and Austin <laughs> voted for... I don't know. The, we voted against that, at least. You know you're going crazy when you hear the Rice Krispies say, Get me some fucking enchiladas. I'm Gazer Pazer. Gazorpazor. Gazorpazor. <laughs> Gazer Pazer. Gazer Pazer. I'm not taking the L on that one. How am I supposed to know that it says fucking Gazorpazor? Gazer Pazer. Gazer Pazer. Sack Crackle mm, Bob. I don't even understand this one. Nobody voted except the audience. <laughs> <laughs> we were all busy saying Gazer Pazer. Or Gazer, Gazer. Sack, <laughs> Crackle, <laughs> and Pop 57 to 43. Wait, Mbop won? Yes. yes. That's badass. I just didn't know what to make of either of those. <laughs> the <laughs> most embarrassing Google search J Smith OTI has entered. Wait, what? Oh. How many questions, or what am I eating? <laughs> Those are so good. <laughs> These are both fair, yeah. <laughs> this is you and me, right, Austin? Yeah. Okay, just make it sure. <laughs> I, I like the idea of you thinking Google would know what you're eating right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really good. Ooh, what am I eating? Close at least, right? 68 to 32. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, wait, could it could be one more percentage. Maybe. Wow, it couldn't it have, though? That would be incredible. <laughs> right, it could. Gazer Pazer. Oh. <laughs> Alright, Google. That's Gazer Pazer. Gazer Pazer. Well, Josh is in first. <laughs> That's bullshit. It's now time for round two. I it's now time for round two. We'll get back on Mondays. You think EI Thankfa and Gazer Pang Gazer hang out? Gazer Pang! <laughs> what is wrong with everyone in this car? Right? I don't know. What is Gazorpazorp? It's, it's uh, from. Uh, oh yeah. my god. Yeah. I'm Gazorpazorp fucking field, bitch. Give me my enchiladas. <laughs> Give me my fucking enchiladas. Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> 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 Uh. Mm. I don't know if mine is a level too deep into being completely unfunny, but it probably is. I feel really no. bad about my answer. <laughs> Thank you, the catfish, for the $2 tip, and S for jellies for Nick, and also at Orion for the subscription. Gazer Pazer. You Gazer have Pazer. 16 seconds. Use a safety clip if you can't think of anything. For what? To enter your last remaining answer, uh, Austin. He's in. Am I, though? These better well, be good. We're about to see. Can't tell, huh? <laughs> the next way airlines will probably try to save money. Blank. Every landing is on the Hudson or higher air traffic controller. <laughs> That's Rob. Wait, what's the air traffic controller? So, air traffic controller is Rob when planes fly over his apartment. Yeah. yeah. They're not being routed over my house today. So I've noticed that, yeah. yeah. Recently, I haven't I heard very live many. I right next yeah. to an airport. Really? But it's like never used. <laughs> 
so oh, okay. it doesn't matter. <laughs> is it really an airport if it's never used then? It's used occasionally. Like, it flies to like two places, I think. Ooh, every landing is on the Hudson. 69%. Ideal. <laughs> yeah, double win. Does it fly Easy. to Gander? It, it does not. <laughs> does it fly to the Gooses? Come on. on. <laughs> the most pointless thing to strap a GoPro camera on. Trick or treat for UNICEF or the DMV line? What's UNICEF? You guys don't know what UNICEF is? I know what UNICEF is. I know what UNICEF is. is. What? You say you guys, it's only Josh there. Josh, you don't know what UNICEF is? <laughs> What's UNICEF? It's the, you know, on Halloween they give all the school kids these boxes. And then when you trick or treat, people are supposed to put money in the box. And then you send it away and it's for, like, charities in the third world. I've never heard of that. Is really? Yeah. <laughs> Austin, is shut up! Really? You, just, you just got safety quipped. <laughs> Safe safety quip lashed, I should say. Yeah. By the oh, DMV line. No, that was me. I I said DMV line. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you, okay. you got the quip lash. A strange thing. I got against me. You no, you got it. What does that mean? You got the quip. You got a thousand points. And he got zero. <laughs> you win good. <laughs> Is it because you win Austin, really big? Austin did a did a. No, it's because everyone voted for you in the group. <laughs> yep. A strange thing to yell when you find your first gray hair. Yes, finally, or by my distinguished balls. I I will say this, that I'm excited to have gray hair, so I'm not voting for yes, finally. I got a uh, a couple of grays this year. Yeah? Really? Yeah. <laughs> Which it, it, where, where were they? They're in my beard. <laughs> you, what? My beard. My, my beard. My beard. <laughs> when are you going to get a mustache with me? That's I, pretty awesome, though. I would I look want, terrible with a mustache. I agree. Yeah, you look Maybe good. Sad. A bald guy cannot grow a mustache unless it's the 20s or, like, he's a corrupt police officer. Those are the only two options. <laughs> Why don't you get a handlebar mustache? That would be That's, better. You don't can't handle me. a bar. <laughs> a murder weapon that should be added to the God. next version of the oh, game, yeah. Clue. Damn it. <laughs> a 9mm Beretta <laughs> or Boredom. <sighs> I'm not voting for it. <laughs> I'm not voting for it. <laughs> voting for what? I'm voting for the other one out of spite. <laughs> just to prevent the quip lag. Wait, why don't you just... Oh, wow, so you don't think mine stands a chance? What? Oh, one what of these is that? yours? Yeah, I am voting for it's it. It's boredom, it's Josh's. Yeah. It lost big time, but I voted for it. <laughs> 67 to 33 for 9mm Beretta. What is the 9mm gun? Uh, it's a different <laughs> meme. Why are there memes all over the place? God. Right. No memes are allowed to be established on days of... If you look at Ryan's uh, oh, chat underneath, it says there are no memes allowed or they're bannable. Yeah. The name of a conference... That's a meme in and of itself. The name yeah, of a know. conference where internet <laughs> trolls gather. TwitchCon or the Northern Lion Live Super Show. Why not both? Why not both? Yeah. Can we vote both? Because you can only vote for one. You can only vote for one. Yeah. That's that's why not both. How many votes are there? Dude. I feel real dirty about putting this in. <laughs> that's okay. I mean, they're both references. One of them is personally insulting, but... <laughs> it won, so, you know, more power to you. It just, I hate winning like that. You should. You, you gotta should embrace that. it. It's the only way yeah. to win. That's, that's fair. That's true. And next... A great way to make friends in a steam room is to remove your towel and... Show them your Gabe Newell tattoo, or give it to the oldest man in the steam room. Steam room. <laughs> I got it. Good one. I, I like both of them a lot. <laughs> but I had to go with my one true love. Gabe Newell. Is it the oldest man? Is it the oldest man? Is the oldest man? So when I said give it to the oldest man in the steam room, I meant the towel, not like, yeah, that's what I not did. bend him <laughs> over and give him the business. I, I Stop fucking him, yeah. yeah that's... This one guy just keeps asking who I am in the chat. <laughs> no, 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 who the fuck is he? Nobody tell him. Nobody Show tell him. them Nobody your Dave Newell tattoo 62 to 38. Alright, it wasn't one level past humor at least. I would say it was probably like three or four stations before humor, if I'm being honest. <laughs> <laughs> well, 62% uh, of the audience doesn't feel that way, Northern Lion. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Rolar. Yep.
Thank you, Brolar, for the resubscription. Thanks, Josh, for keeping me honest. <laughs> Everyone's picking aim at the same prompt this time. Not doing oh, so hot, boys. It's, it's a comic lash. Oh, fuck. No! Someone, what does that mean? Go to Twitch. It, boys. Go, look at the screen, or Austin will screen cap it and put it in Discord. All right, do it, Austin. Well, this is a very pop up. This is a little scary. Oh, kind of, no. Kind of a timely. Uh, Explain the comic. This um, there is a young lady oh, with a protest sign fuck. that says, I forgot, why are we protesting again? And then mm. she's oh. being replied to by a man who wow. you fill the rest in. Okay. Oh, this is way mm. too. Mm. Can we all agree not to do it? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming Josh is not going to follow that rule. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to do it. I'm, a, I'm not going to do it. I'm going to make a shitty reference that's not even that funny because I'm a better man. Yeah, fall is in the grenade. Be, is it going to be EI fang fall? <laughs> Five it's a, it's a bad okay. oh, reference. I accidentally let my computer fall asleep. Okay, soak it in. <laughs> Same. Why do you have okay. sleep? Because well, I wanted to be asleep sometimes, like I am. Okay, I forgot. Why are we protesting again? They let B Rex on the NLSS. Wow. <laughs> I want my nine millimeter Beretta back because it's our money and we need it now. <laughs> Captain America will never submit to Hydra. I don't know. Read the signs. Or where's my Cheetos? Nobody did it. Wait, what? <laughs> where's like, my, my like Cheetos? A, <laughs> it's like a, like a city in Peru or something. <laughs> like, where is my Cheetos? <laughs> is that the Pixies? Yes. Yeah, I think that is the Pixies. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. I like that they have a new it. song on the radio. What do you mean they have a new song on the radio? It's a new song that's on the radio. I hear it yeah. on like my local station. They have a new it's song like, on the radio? Yeah, they got a new, they put an album out like in I don't know, like oh, August or something. The suspense is killing me. Let's see who got you guys ever been medals. to Cheetos? Run. <laughs> no, have Get you? B Rex yeah. is gonna B Rex with the no. self roast. Oh, <laughs> what a gamble! <laughs> That's how you do it. From last to first, Josh, me, <laughs> Nick, Rob, Austin, B Rex. Yes. <laughs> He's learned. Rex, you did it. Show me those Wait, that's two in a row, isn't it? You got the last I one. I think too. he's he's beginning yeah. to believe. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> I always believe. Beginning to believe. Oh, moved him up to second, but Nick maintained the victory. Damn, second oh, yeah. shit. Well, uh, that's Quick Flash 2. We're going to come back in three minutes and play uh, Rocket League Rumble. See you then. Yeah. Well, bye. That's so sad. My best See run was to then. the fucking ice caves this whole time. <laughs> I'm so bad. Uh, who's Where setting we up now? the... I guess I'll invite everybody. All right, all right. I gotta see uh, if I need to restart my computer. Wow. I'm, I'm hopeful I don't. What are you playing? Uh, I'm playing Rocket League, Josh. I'm hopeful that you're <laughs> gonna buy my shirt. <laughs> Rob, can you tell me more about your shirt? Yeah, it's at teespring.com slash store slash alpaca patrol. It's a bunch of alpacas and they're in like, you know, police uniforms. And then there's like a bunch of, there's a veil of smoke covering them. And then, you know, the smoke goes behind them and there's a bunch of jet planes flying overhead. Oh, yeah, I bought that shirt. Yeah. Oh, Barrett. hey, Bear. Barrett. Barrett, oh, you hey can't there. be here. Is that, play? is that Bananasaurus Rex? You don't want to let me play? <laughs> we do, <laughs> we don't have space. I don't, want, I don't want you to play. There's not enough space. I want you to play, Bear. And he doesn't yeah. want me to play. I want you to play, but there's not enough space. They, they don't want me to play, guys. Fair. <laughs> it's, a, it's okay. I, I want you to play, but <laughs> there's not enough space, though. I mean, I'll we don't really go. need Austin. I'll just go play. <laughs> you had to sneak it in. Had to Sorry, do buddy. <laughs> Bear, do you want to be on All my right. safe team? Bear, I no, lied. Don't, I, I want you. You haven't recorded it yet. Don't make alliances yet. You can't possibly <laughs> make alliances now. Bear, be on my safe team. What check if you're the in the opposite wire. corners of the, the continent? That's Ryan, perfect. Check the wire. What does that mean? No, he yeah. hasn't learned yet. This is why we can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna go. Alright. Oh, we'll right. we'll see, see you in an hour, Bear. Yeah, see you in an hour. Holy shit! 1900 bits! I wanted the red badge roll race Dude. thing for you. Thank you for the 1900. That's and only $19. Calm down. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
That's exactly. really good. We're not fucking all wrecked. Fucking, we're not all fucking Monopoly men twisted. All right, all right, all right. Nineteen dollars is a pretty good fucking. Joke. I think. I think I actually do need to restart. <laughs> Sick for you. You Dis gotta restart. Oh. Yeah, despite restarting before the show even started, I think I have to restart again. That's okay. Right. I'll let you do that. This Rocket League's running at like you know zero frames per second right now. Get it. And it needs your to be computer. Yeah. I know, dude. Right. If if it worked. I just wish that it would work fine for everything. It works fine for everything except on the NLSS. It's like, hey, you can't play the third section game. You always have to restart. <clears throat> it's the most weirdly like specific issue. Anyway, I'll be back in three minutes. <laughs>